It retraced after I downloaded the wrong file. Okay, let's get started for real now. Ugh. Oh, good. You're up. Why are you calling me? I thought we agreed no phone calls. Well, you didn't answer any of my 20 texts, so I had to take drastic action. Okay, bye, Owen. No, 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 hold up. One word, Mia. Eh? That fear when Twitch tells me to die? Oh? What happened? Got your attention, huh? Shut up. Anyway, she just texted to say she got the night off and she's on her way. You're not gonna disappoint her by not showing, right? I really hate you sometimes. You'll be fine. I'll see you soon, yeah? It's not you, it's me. My Twitch likes to crash a lot on my browser. Ah, uh, yeah, I remember you saying that. Yeah. Why do I let myself get dragged along by that guy? But if Maya got the night off just to come- I don't know if it's Mia or Maya. I like saying Maya, though. I can't let her down. Come on, Freya. It'll be fun. Remember fun? No, I don't. <laughs> anyway, let's get going. Deep breath. Am I ready to go? Yep. Oh, what's this thing in the corner here? With the numbers. In the upper left corner. That's... Huh. Alright, I can do this. Now what train do I catch? I just noticed that. I'm not sure if that was in the previous version or not. Made it. I said the bus stop should be around here. That's just where your mouse is on screen. On screen. Oh, okay. Owen. Lucas. Owen is the one friend who will not let you feel excluded. <laughs> Speak of the devil. What's that supposed to mean? We were wondering whether you would get lost. So yeah, hello, Barn. How's your day? Hey, give me a little credit. Sorry, and hey, you beat Maya. Oh, she's not here yet? Weird. Well, she better hurry. It's almost time. So, what is this thing, anyway? It's a ghost tour. Famous murder spots, haunted alleyways, that kind of thing. Cool. I always wanted to do that. I've been good, but my back is in pain. Ah, oh, I can relate to that. Hopefully it calms down for you soon. Yeah. It should be interesting. I said you didn't have to come. Uh, that's not what I meant. Alright, and there she is. I'm so sorry, guys. There was a whole thing with Mom, and my phone totally died, and... It's okay. I only just got here, too. Whew. Okay, I'm ready to fight some ghosts. Hell yeah. Please don't. Alright, wait. Let me talk to Mia first. Guess I don't have to worry about being late. Everything okay at home? Yeah, you know how it is. Yeah. But I'm here now, and this is gonna be fun. I don't remember that being a thing that Mia said in the other version, so, hmm. Do you want to stay over at mine tonight? If you don't mind. Or maybe she did. Maybe I just have a bad short-term memory. Where the hell's the tour bus? Also, is it a private tour? I thought there'd be other people. That's what I thought, too. Hmm, not very professional. Maybe you'll have to play the guide instead. Well, as I was saying before... I will. I just need to chill out and relax. Although, cracking a cold one with the boys will help as well. Hell yeah. I'm drinking some Ramune. So, we'll be drinking buddies with the Ramune. Cut it out. I want it to be a surprise. Wasn't the bus supposed to be here by now? What was that? An earthquake? We need to go now. Shit. Finally re okay, yeah, this is the full version then. Okay. Let let's touch Mia's hand. Because we gay. Ow! What the hell? Uh, some nice Pocky and Ramune. Hell yeah. <laughs> Where am I? <coughs> uh. Mia, are you okay? I think so, just bruised. 
Oh my god, it's Shin Megami Tensei 4.9 Final Chapter Prologue! <laughs> what happened? You are a slave. Want emancipation? I have no idea. Well, I guess we'll have to find out. <laughs> Seriously, are you sure you're okay? I'm fine! If you're sure. Is that a person? That looks like... Oh, rope! Score! What about the other... I think there's a dude sitting there. Score? Rope always comes in handy. Let's grab it. At Mia's behest, I took the rope. Okay, but this looks like a... Are you not... There we go. Okay, okay. Um, first... Move him on their side. He just slides behind you. <laughs> Mia, wait. <sighs> His neck, it looks like someone ripped it open. I'm sorry, we'll come back for you. Pick your head up, queen. Don't get your ma makeup messed up, queen. Tempting. No, I can sleep once we get out of here. Huh? There's a hole under it. Should I put something in? Uh, hold on. Probably shouldn't mess with it. Let me see first. That was easy. Let's go! Let me see, can I put the rope in here? I doubt it. I'll leave a note. Freya was here. Oh, okay. With the power of the rope persona, the wings of rebellion shall guide you. Ah, <laughs> uh, we apparently can't go in this room. Wait, where are the guys? I don't know. When I came to, it was just us. That's weird. If we fell, shouldn't we be together? They might have gone ahead. That's definitely possible. Seriously, I'm gonna kick their asses when I find them. <laughs> Mia looks like the type of person that would kick my ass and I'd thank her. Oh. Freya, get back! the fuck? Someone in a costume, maybe? Do you think? You probably shouldn't let it see us, just in case. Okay. Then what? We go in our room? Wait for him to leave or something? I don't know. What do we do? Alright. I guess... Just keep going? Ah. Another body. Are they trying to hide? This looks like a diary. Record me in me your struggles. When you return from your rest, I will recall them for you. I'll be able to remember what I was doing if I record my thoughts here. May as well give it a try. Yeah, let's record your thoughts. All done. A lot of bodies in here. Do you think that's for the cell? Could be. Hope no one minds me taking it. Better to ask forgiveness than permission. The sprites look pretty freaking nice. Same. I really like the art style of this game. I picked up a set of keys. Okay, well, let me see. Can I get into any of these rooms now? Wrong button. Do I have to use them in the menu? Gal keepers keys. Don't know what a gal keeper is. Oh, okay. Um. <laughs> Hello, are you gone? Let's record our thoughts. thing on the bottom that shows up. I'm not sure if that's like sanity or what. Okay. Is he gone? He's gone. Don't let the 
big scary plague doctor to see you. Okay. Whew. Jeez, we gotta be close, right? Official Twitter for the game and the artist who did the art. Ooh, thank you. Let me give them a follow right now. So they're doing a really good job. for sharing that, Yen. Jeez, we gotta be close, right? Close to what? Something. Ooh, I like this character's design. Really cute. There's someone there. Uh, hello? Where are you? I'm in here. Hold on, we're coming. I've seen skeletons in museums before, but this is... Ugh. Can't do this. Waifu alert, it's the really light hair. Yep. Do you ever think the plague doctor man just wants to make friends but everyone keeps stonking and putting in themselves before he can say hi? Maybe. That might be it. You might be onto something, Bon. Uh, he really did it. Of course. Waifu spotted. I'm Mia. This is Freya. Oh, she's got... Every girl with the name Claire seems to be a best girl. Thank you for freeing me, but... But? Well, it's probably safe when I meet there. There's all sorts of monsters in this place. She cute. She is cute. I like her a lot. Yeah, we saw some. You don't happen to know where we are, do you? Sorry, all I know is terrifying place with no way out. That's... If there's no way out, then we'll just have to make one. Huh? Up until now, you were all alone. That must have been really scary. But if we work together, I bet we can get out of here. So, let's go. Does she really believe all of that? She might just be trying to make us feel better, but... You know, if anyone's gonna get us out of here, it's Mia. So, she's that amazing of a person? Absolutely. Wow. Okay then, I'll believe in her too, she's so cute! <laughs> I like her. Hello. You coming? Oh, yes. Sorry. You go ahead, I'll be right behind you. Hmm. It smells like perfume. I want to get some food, but that takes time, and if I miss one piece of dialogue from Claire, I will die. <laughs> you know, that thing has a lot of eyes, but... <clears throat> the way it moves. I just get the feeling it actually can't see that well. It probably should have seen us before, but it ignored us. Huh. Do you think we can sneak around it? Or if we provide enough sensory input to confuse it? Uh, I guess you can't really use human psychology on something like that. I have a bad feeling about Claire. I can I can see that. She looks kind of like a ghost. I like it when you talk about psychology, though. You sound so passionate. H hey, come on. Yay. Yeah, stop getting in my way. Thank you. Claire could rip out everyone's guts in front of me, and I would still be ooh ooh baby about her. <laughs> Yeah! Ow! You didn't really think kicking it would work, did you? They lesbianine! <laughs> it might have. Besides, see the shadow between it and the wall? There's something hidden here. But I'm not sure I can move it. Owen's been lifting weights lately. Wonder if he could do it. Oh, good point! We'll get him to try when we find him. Okay, so... Well, let's hope that he's still alive. It unlocked. Let's go! Are there chase scenes in this game? So why is Mia scared of anything when she can phase through the walls just because she wants to? <laughs> Whoa, it's huge. <coughs> why do we... Do, why do I feel like we're not gonna find Owen? Same. God, it stinks. I'm guessing whoever you hold hands with is the person that lives and everyone else dies. More bodies. 
What the hell is going on? You've been here for a while, right? Mm, I'm not sure how long exactly. There's no way to tell the time after all. But I can tell you what I know. How did you get here? Um, I was waiting for someone, and then the ground started to shake. The next thing I knew, I was here. Sorry, that wasn't helpful, was it? Please don't apologize. That was really helpful, right, Freya? Yeah, it's the same way as us. I'm really glad I could help. And holding saves lives. Heard it here first, folks. Well, that's hella lewd, but if it saves lives... But please, don't try to fight it. I don't want to see anyone else get hurt. And holding is lewd and stops you from entering heaven. <laughs> Sorry, no can do. We're gonna get out of here, and that includes you. Alright, let's start looking. Let's save first. Record my thoughts. Wear gloves. <laughs> so that you can have protection when hand-holding. If it's okay with you, I think I'll stay here. Do you think I would ever enter Heaven Bart? I mean, honestly, I think everyone in chat would be in hell. <laughs> I'm sorry. I know it's cowardly. It's okay, baby. We'll come back for you, alright? You've done nothing wrong. You okay? Define okay. Finally, my migraine is slowly going away. Sheesh. Oh, I'm glad you're getting better again. Alive. Not giving up. Yeah, I'm okay. You? You know it. I can absolutely tell you that I would walk into hell and then take over. <laughs> I'm going to purgatory because both God and Satan want nothing to do with me. <laughs> Same injuries as the one in the south. Those sentinel things look pretty strong. Could they have done this? Sentinel? What do you mean? Talking about the dude that's like the plague doctor? Or is that something I should have read late later on in the game? <laughs> what is this? Ah, it goes back down. Yee yee. Psychology. No good. Doesn't look like I've got the right way for this key for this. I mean, I can't talk. <laughs> Whoever said I knew how to speak English. Not good. There are three locks, and I definitely don't have the right keys. That hole up there is probably big enough to fit through, though. You thinking what I'm thinking? Come on, let me up on your shoulders. Of course, we could go to hell. We're throwing love and affection on each other in between threatening to steal each other's organs and sell them for profit. <laughs> It's just how chat be. What are you, Lara Croft? Lara Croft? Why are you making me blush? That, that's not... Anyway. What if you can get back to on... Huh? What if you can get back up on the other side? We could use that rope you found. You sure you want to use that? No time to be squeamish. Hello, Styx. How are you doing today? Having a good day? Should I let her? Um... No. There's probably nothing behind there anyway. But it's a locked door! We can come back to it later, okay? Alright. I don't know, that doesn't sound like the solution, so... Just give me a moment. Just give me a moment, Mia. Once I've exhausted all of my dialogue options. You okay? Kinda dark in here. The music kinda spooky too. Okay. Okay, I can't go up there. My day's been fine, just finished supper. Nice. I still need to eat myself. Okay, so there's like some what are those, like, axes? Hang on. 
What are you doing? Holding your hand so I can pull you out if there's trouble. Right. God, they so gay. One's for sorrow, two for joy. Three for a girl, four for a boy. Five for silver, six for gold. Seven for a secret never to be told. Well? It was some kind of nursery rhyme. One for sorrow. Oh, the magpie song. You know it? Yeah, it's like however many magpies you see is what you'll get. Or something like that. Huh. Stop starving, Elio. I'm sorry. I'll, I'll eat in between games. Huh. Alright. I call six. <laughs> okay, so I can't examine the... Or maybe I'm not... Okay. Gross. Poor little guy. I wish we could bury him or something. Should I take him? Why not? You know, you could always use a hand. You know? A ginger oh, it's a dead magpie. Anyway, I gingerly pick up the dead magpie. So those things are magpies. Sorry. <laughs> Elio, don't make me try to cook for you. It probably won't be good enough, but you need the food. So <laughs> thank you for the offer, Yen. Also, anyone can cook better than me. <laughs> Elio only needs one thing to be sustained. And that's my simp energy. <laughs> Two words, Yuri titties, hell yeah. No good, I can't get it open. Simp energy also applies. <laughs> There's no way it'd be that easy. A girl can dream. Is it pizza or maids or better maids serving pizza? God, you guys all know me way too well. Okay, so what's this confession booth do? Empty and locked. All right, I guess that's it then for this area. Let me just save. Don't wanna forget that I grabbed a dead bird off the floor. Yuri in a maid outfit serving pizza, that's it. Yo, that's like the ultimate life form. Okay, so let's see. I'm pretty sure we're talking about male Yuri, but I'm um, thinking DDLC Yuri and I love her. The answer is yes, June. The answer is yes to both of that. The store's slightly ajar. I'm with you, okay? Okay. At least I don't like the way that you guys said that. familiar somehow. So creepy. Is that Claire? Maybe it's just because she's wearing white. Two o'clock. Soon is too much for me. I was not prepared for this. <laughs> yeah, that's June. So we've either been here for four hours or 16. It was snipped cleanly off. And there's a dead body on the couch. Fun. A thin dark red mark circles her throat. There's small scratches around it too. You're albino, Goldie? I didn't know that. What about the okay, there's nothing there to examine. all to do in here then. So we've, I've been here for six, for four hours or 16. Wow. Okay. I guess that's not the way out. Oh, wow. Hold on. There's like multiple doors here apparently. Or 
Yep, I am. Sun burning me in like three minutes included. Oh. Guys, I'm so tired, so I'm very sorry for not talking much. My brain is just way too empty right now. It's all good, huh? Good, take it easy. Some kind of fight? But they don't lead anywhere. Looking closer, there are some black hairs stuck to the blood. Hmm. Some kind of diorama. Nothing happens when I touch it. Yo, give me some noodles, June. Come over and give me some noodles. Ahongi. Hmm. Oh, got a bunch of books. None of them I can examine, though, I'm guessing. There aren't any words on the spines. Can't even take them off the shelves. Not much of a library. <laughs> so it just looks like it's a library, then. Oh. Hello. That necklace. I took the golden neck. There was a necklace there? I didn't even notice. Okay, we're not gonna... Oh. I'm guessing I took it off of the statue. Okay. Alrighty. Don't know what... I guess I could just wear it to look pretty. Maybe that's just it. Hello, Mia. This room would be really pretty if it wasn't for, uh... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Can I grab that? You should probably grab that. It looks like a knife. Oh, yeah. That reminds me. So, we have actually two that I have to do for that. What a dirty adult you are. And what a dirty adult you are. <laughs> because, uh, I think it was, I think it was Joe Mama that sent in a request when you weren't here, and he was like, do, do this when Hagu comes back. Okay, how do I get out of here? I'm saving up my points for Uwu speak. <laughs> Wait, okay, so that's the way out. Go back in. I think there's another room over here. Hello! Okay, we're gonna be speaking in Uwu speak. Thank you. No, good. Doesn't look like I've got the right key for this. Okay, let's find our way out here then. Okay, let's go. Let's go! Alright, how do we get out of here? Alright, there we go. Let me see. Called my thoughts. I'm one hell of a worker. <laughs> oh, we can go in here. Oh, wait, no, I was already in here. <laughs> How do I get around here? I guess I gotta do the whoop thing. Nya, 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 nya. Of course you would want the nyas, June. You're a cat boy. Enthusiast. And also a cat boy yourself. You sure you wanna use it? No time to be squeamish. Come on, let me up. Should I wet her? Yes. Cause there's no harm in trying. Yes, I'll wait, squat down. Let's go. We're getting all the chat rewards today, aren't we? Good. She's heavier than she was. Don't look up, Priya. Wait. No, she's wearing shorts. It's fine. Yay! Hop, hop. Wow, it's super dark in here. And echoey. Some kind of huge cave, maybe? No, good without a white, though. And what about the door? Oh, there's something barring it. Hold up, I think I can... Got it. Ooh, well. Okay, I think I can talk normally now. I'll get all those redeems going on. We're gonna be losing all the points. <laughs> Guess we still have to find the keys. 
Trying to save up again since I feel poor when I have less than 5,000 points. <laughs> Alright, I'm coming back. Well, that sucked. At least we know now. Yeah. Oh well. Onwards. Hey Claire, you got anything new to say? It's a play- okay. Alright. I need the keys. Some injuries. Oh, woe speak instead of uwu speak? Wait, what's the difference though? Oh, well, and uwu, they're like the same thing. What? You can't be using the dare to get around the owo oh, thing, June. I know what you're doing. Owo oh, is more curious, I suppose? Oh, okay. No good? I can't get it open. There's no way it'd be that easy. I don't know, I don't know. <laughs> Broken dream. Okay, what, what am I supposed to do in this game? I wanted to... <sighs> hmm. Whoa, is more suggestive? Hmm. I don't know. Alright. Let me see. Okay, it doesn't look like I got the right key for this. This is for June. Confess your feelings to Elio on stream. <laughs> Kami has not prepared me for June. What is this rich craft? <laughs> Besides the same coin. One light, one dark, forever spinning in a cosmic dance of purposelessness. <laughs> that is the true natures of Owo and Uwu. <laughs> Why, where did that Sunnel thing go? Did it disappear somewhere? I love Elio, he's been nothing but a positive influence on my life and I hope to bring him a lot of joy in the upcoming future. <laughs> John! <laughs> That's gay. That's gay. You're gay, June. <laughs> well, I'm not going to complain. Now we can come and go as we like. Always looking on the bright side. It's blessed and gay. Hey, bro. Freya, is something the matter? Yes, there is a dead body in front of us. I just wonder if there are any clues, but I can't see any. Let's just move on. Hmm. Ain't, ain't that like a normal thing to do to examine dead bodies? Why, why are you so surprised, Mia? That's gone. No point sending another. Okay, can we not get into these rooms still? I guess we just had to see that the note was gone, I guess. <laughs> Smells like perfume. Can I examine this dead body? room doors easily blend in in this game, so I might be missing some rooms. Especially because it's dark. Okay. Well. Okay. Sorry. Still can't do that. I got off work this morning at 7 a.m. and thought about dropping by Elio's place to surprise him. You should have. <laughs> I would love to see you again. Not simp before the year turn to die. Chapter 3 starts. There's gore stuck to it. I hate to say it, but it could come in handy, right? Oh, now you guys are picking up the knife. Okay. 
And let's at least wipe it off. Mia cleaned and then handed me the silver knife. Now we got the knife. Okay. Guys, I just realized I haven't eaten anything and it's almost five where I live. Yeah, yeah, go, go get some food to eat. Please, eat, please. What room was it? I think there was like a thing. Oh wait, hold on. Is that a room? Stab someone. The door is bolted from this side. That seems ominous somehow. Still, I unbolt it. Why do I have a bad feeling about this? Ooh. Oh no. This was where... This is where the dude was. And there wasn't blood when I got here the first time. Hey, Freya? Freya, come on, say something. Why, it's fine, right? It's just a coincidence, right? Anyone could wear a hoodie that color, right? Oh no! Stop it, Mia. This is definitely Owen. Welp, we were right. Owen is dead. Then we need to get him out of here. Mia, it, it's no good. Rip Owen. <laughs> Huh? Around his neck. I took Lucas's pendant. Well, I guess we're not gonna get that rock moved anytime soon. No, I should probably leave this with him. He's not wearing his ring either. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I should've... There must've been some way I could've saved you. Alright. Well... Goldie? Goldie, you called it. You got it. I wish I didn't. <laughs> Can I take these flowers? They look different from the others. Sunflowers. They're not really cheering me up, but Owen liked these. Oh, I took the sunflowers. I'm calling Lucas, though, because of the black hair and blood. Oh, you're right. You're not gonna read what it says on there? Okay. There's something in here. Freya was here? Wait, I remember this. Are those two rooms linked somehow? Huh. Oh boy. Well. Okay, just not gonna examine the names on the them anymore. Okay. Only the gays survived. Damn. But what if Owen and Lucas were gay? What if they were dating each other? How do I get out of here? Well. That. That was something. Okay. Anyone over here? No. Let me see, is there anything that I can do with the confession now? One for sorrow, two for joy. Oh yeah, this is like the magpie song. Maybe we can put the mag... No? Oh. Oh. Well. <laughs> huh. Only the lesbian survived, damn. Empty and locked. No good, can't get it open. There's no way it would be that easy. A girl can dream. <laughs> um, let's see. Hold on. Oh wait, there's circles there, aren't there? It took me a while to realize that there are circles here. Because of how dark it is. Um, let's see. Um. Hey, bro, do you think you can put the sunflowers in Owen's casket? Oh. 
And it was for sorrow, right? This is pretty sorrowful. Heard some kind of mechanism. Guess it worked. Oh, okay. So then two? Is this two? Oh, six for gold. Okay. Looks like it worked. So this this has to be two. Two is for joy. Okay, I guess we're using it here. And then five is for silver. Pretty sure this is silver anyway. Never would have found that out on my own, but okay. Get I get it. Looking for items that correspond to the song. Yeah. Now that I realize what I was doing, that makes sense. No good. I can't get it open. There's no way it'd be that easy. Okay. So I guess... I guess we just... Did the music change? Let me see. Got anything else to say, Mia? E. Okay. Okay. Alrighty. Now what do we do? Wait, can we enter here now? We need keys. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Let me go back. Let me go back. I just noticed that there's blood here. Is this a door? Something's blocking it from the other side. Oh, okay. Good. Claire's deaf gonna die off screen. <laughs> she's either gonna die or she's one of the killers. And keys. Maybe should we go back down? Examine this. I like how she's still saying we need Owen to move this when Owen is dead. Where is the screen? What are you talking about? <laughs> Any of these open? I'm just trying to find, like, something had to have opened, right? Wait, did I not examine the thing? I'm feeling kind of stupid right now. Did I not examine the, the treasure chest? I'm guessing I missed something in that one room. Never said I was a brain genius. This is me with our RPG make or horror exploration games. I never remember where I'm going. Okay, so let's see. What was the song again? Am I missing one? One for sorrow, two for joy. Oh, three for a girl, four for a boy. Okay. So we need three. Three's for a girl. Maybe if one of us sits on it? Worth a shot. Looks like it worked. But does that mean I have to stay here? Do you mind if I do that last? I kind of want to stick with you. Oh, um, yeah, of course. Uh, gay. Gay. Okay. Hmm. Wait. Hmm. Four for a boy. Guess we could try to find Lucas, but. Oh, okay. There's an indentation. It's practically begging me to put something there. Uh, maybe we can go back to that room and get, like, the black hair, maybe? Do you know where we can find a boy? Okay. You don't know where I can find a boy. Gotcha. It was... I think that's not a boy, but let me see. Do we have to get <laughs> Owen's corpse? Oh, oh.
Uh, trying to calm down, but Jesus Christ, am I irritated? Ah, uh, I'm sorry about that, Hagu. Let me see. Let me first check. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I'm guessing it's that we have to get the corpse of Owen. Alrighty. Let me see. Hello! Hello, Jackie! How are you doing? We're playing Retrace. Okay, I guess we gotta go and get Owen's corpse. Ha ha ha. Maybe we can just take a little piece. Four for a boy. Yep, we gotta get Owen's corpse. Huh? The rhyme. Four for a boy. We need a boy. Yeah, called it. <laughs> no, Freya, we can't. We don't have a choice. Help me move him, please. <laughs> mm, uh, looks like we moved him then. Is he in my inventory? No, he's not. Okay. Can you examine? <laughs> okay. <laughs> also, I want to know what the fuck this says. Why are you not saying what it says, Freya? Alright. Nope. Oh. We got the body. Okay. Well, we got our boy. Oh, God. It worked. God. Also, it looks like he's, like, got stabbed to the point where you can, like, see his rib cage. I think. Thank God. Owen. No. We'll grieve for him when we're out of here. We've got to keep going for his sake. Right, Freya? Hmm. Alright. Guess it's my turn, huh? Please don't be dead! Please don't die from this! Yes! I reach into the chest and retrieve an ornate key. Eat his heart! <laughs> Imagine having to carry your best friend's corpse to solve a fucking puzzle, Jesus Christ, right? Huh. What is it? Some kind of fancy key. I'm grieving. <laughs> You're grieving by wanting to eat his heart, I see. After all that, I guess we're done in here, huh? Guess so. I'm guessing Claire might have done this, perhaps? <sighs> oh, you're back again. Hello, baby. You seem despondent. Did something happen? Yeah. Forgive me, that was an insensitive question. No, it's... it's okay. One of our friends, he... Mia really just stepped off the button as soon as Freya reached in the chest, yeah. What if it... Banged down on our MC while she's reaching in. <laughs> God. I'm so sorry. He is trying to disarm our MC. <laughs> Guess we gotta suspect Mia now, too. What a beautiful key. You know, don't you think it's around the right size for that big door? Huh, I hope so. Amazing! I've been looking for those three keys for so long, and you already found one. Oh, um, thanks. Guys, can you guys send me stuff to keep me distracted, please? I'm just so irritated right now, I just can't stop crying from anger. Oh, I'm sorry, Hagu. Also, thank you, June. Thank you for sending Hagu some pics of your cat. This key matches the door, but... Do we seriously have to find two others? Come on. Yo, what if every key has to have your friends tie die? Just give me a minute. I need a rest. Yo, what's this music? Hmm. 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 You both seem exhausted. Yep. 
You poor things have been through so much. This music. It's okay to close your eyes. I'll watch over you. I... I like you, Clear, but... Can I trust you, though? No, I'm good. I just gotta... Ugh. Mia. Clear says she says. It's okay. You don't have to be strong for me. Huh? But... <laughs> Being strong's about all I'm good for, though. Don't give me that sad look. I'm fine. I'm... Aw, baby. Hey, Freya. Do you mind if I just rest on you for a little bit? I will always trust pretty girls. <laughs> You're so warm. You two really care about each other, don't you? I'm a little jealous. You're not gonna... You're not gonna kill us out of jealousy, are you? Freya, it's okay for you to close your eyes, too. No. I should be trying to escape, shouldn't I? I it just got dark. Shh. Everything will be okay. Uh, don't... Just rest for now. You're, you're trying to get me to rest a bit too much, Claire. Like, asking once is enough. The way that you keep saying this is really... Claire go... Mia end. Oh? Oh, we already got the end? Hmm. What? Where am I? So cold. Kill us, Claire. Did she kill us? Did I die? Is this hell? Finally, she awakens. Uh, who are you? You may call me Matem... Matemna. Now, don't give me that look. You should be joyful. After all, you've just evaded the jaws of death. I... what? How? I guess Claire did kill us, or...? I'm certain you have many such questions. Alas, I have no answers. My role is simply to facilitate your return. That path that leads to your death. Wouldn't you like to retrace it? I... you're giving me a second chance? Second, third, fourth... Frey is here again. <laughs> As long as you possess this power, and the will to use it, you may try as many times as you like. So, how do I... The tomes behind me keep records of your travels. Go on. I guess I don't have much of a choice. Alright. It's blank. It reads, I met my friends at the bus stop. Should I go through? Not, not this one. It reads, I took Mia's hand and woke up in the dungeon. The pages should I go to? Oh, okay. Demon reviving us for different routes. Character name Claire. Welcome to Witch's Heart 2. Goodbye despair, everybody. <laughs> so looks like there's... So we could do this outcome to get us into the other routes, looks like. So red is for Mia, which we already got. And red corresponds to this, which we got one ending. So there's another ending for Mia. And then... This should be Owen and Lucas, and I'm guessing this is, like, True Root, I'm guessing. That's gonna be my guess. Okay. So, should I do M Mia's other end, try and find what that is? Or should I do the boys? This is Roots. Uh, let's see. Hagu, I tweeted at you. Thank you for sending Hagu some pics. Alright, let me see. I think I'm gonna do... Lucas, maybe? Cause I kind of... Maybe we try for her other end? Okay. No. We'll do Mia. We'll do Mia, then. Got you guys. Surprise! My pal who did the art for this game is a Witch's Heart fan. Ooh. <laughs> let me see. Okay. So, let's try and find how to get the other end. So, it said Mia end, so does that mean Claire has an end? Let's see. The, let's see. Hmm. Let me see. Ah, da, da, da. Hold on. Hold on, wait, 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 wait. I kind of want to 
want to do the other ones first. outside. You okay? You don't look so good. Oh, um. Is that because I remembered shit? I can't stop it. All I can do is try a different path. I blindly reach out and grab the hands. Let's do Lucas. Ow. What the hell? Where am I? Ugh. I, I'm sorry, I just like black-haired boys with long hair. What can I say? Oh, we can return to the void now, huh? Okay. Lucas, what are you doing? Testing the gravity. You appear to be on Earth, or at least an Earth-sized planet. Unless they've invented artificial gravity, can't rule that out. You might be right. Good attitude. We must consider all possibilities. But why would someone do that? I'm not sure. It needs more clues. To be honest, I'm more worried about Owen and Mia right now. Weren't they right beside us? Oh, did did you just touch me, Jim? Oh, thank you. Oh, you gotta walk through for me. Thank you. I will pull that up on my phone then. Let me check. Actually, for me, is ending. Walk through with all endings. Phase room, lobby, Lucas. Lucas. So we got Lucas end. Mia end. Maya end. Claire end. Okay, let me see. I think Claire should be the other ending then, right? Use the red book pedestal engineer. Interact with the star in the starting cell. Get the skeleton's key of the pedestal. Oh, okay. Uh, let me do that. It is odd. We won't find them standing around here, shall we? He doesn't seem too perturbed. Not that he's ever perturbed by anything, but. I'm gonna try for Claire's end, then. Let's return to the void. Sorry, my dude. I'll come back for you later, once we get Claire's end. All right. So let's see. So let's go to the dungeon. Since we gotta get caught by the sentinel. It worked, I'm back. I have to do everything again. Come on, brain. Cooperate with me here. It's fine. I can do this. Just keep thinking of Mia, Owen, and Lucas. I can't let them down. Alright. Well, first, let's interact with this. It's gone. Okay. Okay, okay. Um, first, roll them on their side. Mia, wait. Gah. His neck. Looks like someone... Okay, we saw that. Hey, come catch me, bro. Freya! Well. Time look bullshit. <laughs> Mia? Hey, Mia. It stopped, so you can get up now. Mia? No. Oh, God. Please. Mia! <laughs> this can't be happening. Mia, please, I need you. You can't just leave me here. Shit, it's still nearby, I can't stay here. Deep breaths, Freya, I should at least close her eyes. It stepped right on her neck, her scarf is covering it. Dear God, bad end confirmed. So we got the good end our first try, so that's nice. Should I look? Oh, ho, ho, ho. I guess we'll look. It's all blotchy and red. I can see the outline of her spine where the skin is squished against it. Hey, Mia. Why did you do that? You could have escaped. I didn't want this. 
Her face is missing. What am I supposed to do without you? I took the light blue scarf. Is that dude still gonna be there? Okay, guy. You just, you just gonna let me walk past you? Okay. Okay. All of its eyes are fixed on Mia. Is it guarding her? I'm sorry, Mia. I'll come back for you, I promise. Well. Well, 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 well. Let's get out of here, then. Claire is our new best friend. <sighs> Somehow, I made it. Is someone there? Ah! Yeah, let's get our waifu in our party. And stay in our waifu. Friendship with Mia came to a bloody end. Claire is now our best friend. Uh, you really did it. Yeah. Um, I'm Claire. Freya. Thank you for freeing me, Freya. No problem. Um, I heard a scream earlier. I'm sorry. This place is filled with monsters. Until you got here, I think I was the last one left. I see. It's probably better to die like that, I think. There's no way out of here, so... I've been down here a very long time, and no one has escaped. Until us. Huh? Mia didn't die for me to give up and wait for death. I'm going to go find my friends, and we're gonna find a way out of here. So there's a good and bad end per character, looks like. Coming? Okay. You still not gonna follow us? Oh, yes, sorry. You go ahead. I'll be behind you. Alrighty then. So I'm guessing we would need this if we did Owen's route. I'm guessing, maybe? It unlocked. Ugh, it stinks. Sorry, I guess I got used to it. Why are you apologizing? Oh, uh, um, sorry. Oh? Huh? I mean, I just... It's been so long, I don't really know what to say. Yeah. So, um, what kind of things do you like? Huh? Like, books? Or music or something? Oh god, I just saw MC's RPG AUR and it really made me feel a lot better. So uh, I'm not great, but I'm feeling better. So I'll try to talk a bit more often now. Well, I'm glad you're feeling a bit better now, Hagu. But yes, don't force yourself to have to talk if you don't want to talk. But yeah, I hope you just have a fun time. I hope you feel a lot better now. Well, I know you just said it, but... <laughs> like, books or music or something? Sorry, you probably want to concentrate. Uh, let me see. Should I say yeah? No. No, it's okay. You're so kind. Well, um, what kind of rabbits do you like? I mean... I mean, you know, this is my name. I'm Starry Bunny Boy. Uh, they're so cute. Actually, you remind me of a rabbit somehow. Is it because it's in my username? What's that supposed to mean? It's just a feeling, I guess. Yeah, let's record my thoughts. It's been a while since I've been out here. Has it changed? Well, the body decomposed more. Ah. Uh. Oh, hey, now you're in this room with us. Nice. It's like something out of a murder mystery. I wonder if she just teleports and that's why she's like, Oh, just let- I'll be right behind you. Don't- don't notice that I'm a ghost that's teleporting. There's some substance on these keys, too. Was someone mid-song? A thin dark mark. Small scratches. Nothing there to examine. There's a classical music record here. 
Do you want to dance with me? Kidding. Yo, that's gay clear. Yes, let's dance. What a beautiful silverware set. Hmm? Looks like there's something missing. Hmm, so I guess I gotta find a silverware set now. Was there a book in here last time? I don't remember there being a book on the table last time. Something lying here. Take the silver knife. Are you okay? You look pale. I'm trying not to throw up. Oh, oh, goodness. Um, I don't have any medicine. Claire's a good girl. I, I feel sad that I doubted her. She's a good girl. No, it's... Let's just get out of this room. That's a good idea. E. Alright. Let me just examine around there. Any words? E. Not much of a library. There's the necklace up here too, right? I took the golden necklace. There. I don't think there's anything else new in the room. So let's get going. Oh, she's following me now. Nice. I like this room. It's pretty. Okay. Um, let's see. <laughs> now me is striked out. It's kind of diorama. Nothing happens when I touch it. Claire is really good. I haven't met a single Claire that has been bad, so I trust her with my life. I should have also agreed with that when I first started the game and I regret it. Are you looking at something new now? It's like, okay, no, you just moved. Alrighty. Record my thoughts. So what items do I have? Do I still have the, okay, I still got everything. And that, okay. No good, don't got the right key. Alright. Well, we're in the mag cat room. Or not why did I say mag cat? Magpie. I was thinking of Hello Charlotte, apparently. <laughs> okay. Let me gross. Are you squeamish for ya? Kinda. Can't really afford to be now though. Should I take it? Yeah, take it. We need it. So brave. I don't need to get back in there, thank god. Maybe I shouldn't say that in a chapel. <laughs> Alright. What about this? This locking mechanism looks quite complicated. There must be some way to open it. Empty and locked. Wow! <laughs> and it's for sorrow, right? This is pretty sorrowful. There's an indentation, practically begging me. What was the... It's looks for gold. It looks like we still need to carry Owen's corpse. Okay. Well, time to find his corpse then. Are you ready to find a corpse, Claire? I think we're ready to find a corpse. Yep, it's still there. Okay. Sunflowers. They're not really cheering me up. Eat. Alright. Well. Sorry, Owen. Why? I'm so sorry. Well, we still need to... Yeah, we still need to carry him. That's... Give me a hand. Yes, of course. <laughs> I can carry him if you like. Don't get the... I'm wearing black, so if the blood gets on me, it'll be no big deal. But if red gets on your beautiful white dress... Are you sure? I'm stronger than I look. All Claire's are strong, after all. Besides, it would be cruel to make you do it. Thanks. Alright. Well, let's get out of here, then. You got anything new to say? It's cold. I don't like it here. I want Claire to kick me and punt me into the stratosphere. Okay, we got all of our stuff now. It's 
pretty fast to get through these endings now that I know what to do. <laughs> it worked. What a relief. Hmm. Same, Elio. You're a man of culture, Barn. Well done, Freya. Now I shall do my part. Thank you, Claire. Got an ornate key. Huh. A key? I wonder what it's for. I love Claire. I've only known Claire for about an hour and a half. If anything happened to her, I will kill everyone in this chat and then myself. <laughs> she is very beautiful and pure and kind and wonderful and strong. In any case, that was wonderfully done, Freya. You're so clever, Kashikoi. Hmm. Is something wrong? I just... It's a point, right? My friends are dead and I'm... What? Solving puzzles? You don't like the puzzles? Yeah, Jackie, please don't call us out. We're just wanting to simp in peace. It was kind of like a scavenger hunt, wasn't it? Don't you like those? Sure, when there aren't dead bodies everywhere. And when I have to carry my dead friend's body over to solve the puzzle as well. Oh, yes. Of course. I like how she stayed in place. Mia just moved the moment I got up to the treasure chest. See, Claire is best girl. You look pensive. I just wasn't expecting something like this here. It's strangely peaceful, isn't it? Hmm, that's not quite the feeling I get. I mean, we got two dead bodies in this room, Claire. I see. I suppose my senses are a little worked by now. Claire is a keeper. She really is. Poor thing. All right, let's get out of here, Claire. She's very good. I love her. Alright, let's get your ending then, Claire. It fits, but we still need two more. Enough already. You've had enough? Yeah. I just want it to be over. No more puzzles. No more death. Just peace. I couldn't save anyone. Mia, Owen, even Lucas is probably... Do you think there's a way you could have warned Owen about that trap? Uh-huh. Uh, never mind. There's no use dwelling on such things, right? How did you know it was a trap, Claire? Uh... If Claire is a yandere, I wouldn't complain one bit, said the low-key yandere enthusiast. <laughs> no good. This is no good at all. Girls who are pretty and can potentially kill me get the best girl award. You get it. Also, I like yandere, so... If she turns out to be that way, that's just a plus. What are you saying? You haven't given up, have you? I... It's okay. I can tell. Your spirit won't accept this fate so easily. Close your eyes, okay? Why? Just trust me. Oh, should I trust her? I think I'm gonna trust her. Let's trust her. Okay. Thank you. Y'all, I don't think that's help. Hopeless end. Oh, was that not Claire's end? Shit. What is this? What is this? Oh, okay. Okay, I guess I got a different ending. Hopeless end. Maybe that was Claire's ending? I didn't get a CG for it though, so I'm not sure. All right. She gives up her happiness to let you get a better ending with her friends. Her kills you to help you get the different endings. What a girl. Alright. Should I do Lucas or should I do Owen this run? A part of me wants to help Owen because we've been carrying around his dead body. But at the same time, Lucas be, Lucas be hella fine. Also, I notice. What happens if you keep your eyes open, though? That's a good question. Kinda wanna see my boy Owen, like, alive. Yeah, that's very valid, Goldie. Let's go keep him alive this time. Alright. 
I'm back outside. Oh, um... I can't stop it. Let's grab Owen's hand. Just this once. Yeah, let's have him let... Hopefully, he's like laying down, so hopefully he's not already dead. Ow! What the hell? Where am I? Ow, ow, ow. Okay, he's still alive. He's still alive. Okay, we good. Freya. Hey, you okay? Sore. Also confused. And probably gay as well. Tell me about it. Wait, no? Wait, what do you mean? Goldie. Okay, so you felt that, right? The ground disappearing, I mean. His design re reminds me of Thomas. Shut up. Oh, God. No, don't point that out to me. I'm not sure what I felt. Ugh, and where the hell are Lucas and Mia? They were right next to us, so they can't be far. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Let's go find them. Toma, if he wasn't a piece of shit. Ugh. Are you sure you're okay? You might have cracked something. It's fine. Let's go already. Sorry, I'm like hitting my mic. Sorry about that. Seriously? Yo! I like this music. Is this Owen's theme? It's kind of bopping. What's up? Okay, but he's a better boy than Toma, so everyone shut up and forget what I said. <laughs> Yo, this theme! Be bopping. I was thinking one of these might be a secret lover. You know, like, in the movies? Nothing yet, though. kind of out of place. It's like begging to be stolen. Wow. Someone might get mad if we do that. Well then, they shouldn't have left it here. Should I take it? Yes. Take it. I pocketed the gold necklace. Aw, yeah. <laughs> God damn it, Owen. <laughs> the speed is kind of funky. Hold up. Oh, there's a key here. Picked up a set of keys. Oh, sweet. They're not labeled. Doesn't matter. It's gotta be a lock somewhere. And when we find it, we're gonna lock the shit out of it. Glad you're having fun. I'm in a time loop situation. Someone's gotta balance you out, Miss Morose. I'm not morose. Maybe I'm balancing you out, sunshine boy. Ever think about that? A thief? I already love him. Same. Whatever. <laughs> Alright. Okay, it doesn't look like I've got the right key for this. I'm glad we did Owen's route. His, his theme be bopping. I'm really liking this music. Music in this game is really good. Both the art and the music and everything is really good. No okay. good. Looks like I... Doesn't look like I got the right key. Owen is a very good boy. I love every one of the characters here. Can I marry them all? <laughs> What's up? I was thinking one of these might be a secret lover. Yeah, okay. Let me see. Are these even real books? Don't think so. They're glued down. So, are we on some kind of set? Oh, maybe on one of those tourist dungeon things. Was there one of those near where we were? Come on, let me have this. I don't want to think about the alternative. Alright. What's up? Oh, okay. Alright. Oh, did I examine this? What the hell is this? It's a plaque. Farmer must transport a wolf, a sheep, and a cabbage across the river from the left bank to the right. That reminds me of the Alice Mere puzzle. He can take no more than two in his boat. This is exactly like the Alice Mere puzzle. But left alone, a wolf will devour a sheep, and a sheep will devour a cabbage. 
so I just have to solve this puzzle. Not like I have much of a choice. I'll do it now. I think I remember the solution to this. I need the wolf, the sheep, and the cabbage to be on the same side. First, I should move... Let me see. Hmm. Wasn't it... Sheep? This is the riddle my father used to tell me all the time. It's that freaking puzzle that's everywhere. <laughs> Do the sheep. I'm on the right side with the sheep and the wolf and cabbage are on the left. I should wasn't it go back alone. Back on the left bank. Now out of the cabbage and wolf I should move. Let's see. The cabbage. Okay, cabbage to the right, and I've got the sheep, cabbage, and shepherd on the right bank. Uh, you take the sheep back, right? Now the shepherd is on the left bank with the wolf and sheep. I'll move the wolf. The wolf and the cabbage are on the right bank. And then go back alone. Now I just have to bring the sheep back over and... Huh. Holy shit. Nice job, Frey. <laughs> Thanks. I played this in a bit too many RPG Maker games. Especially Alice Mayer because I replayed that game like 5,000 times. Shall we proceed? Why, I think we shall, good sir. <laughs> I, I, <laughs> ladies first. Uh, no, in creepy libraries, it's definitely gentlemen first. Ah, uh, damn it. All right, come on. I bet the others are just through there. Yeah, they're probably just through there and dead. <laughs> yeah, I really like their dynamic. I really like her dynamic with Mia as well because they gave for each other. But I like friends, and like the one that's being all like, Oh, I'm stupid, I'm gonna lighten up the situation. Okay. Oh, there is a key in there. Let me grab that. I took the wolf key. I'm locked. What the fuck? Ugh, it stinks. And over there, is that... Seriously, what the fuck? Hey, hey, Lucas, Mia! Be quiet. Huh? I think maybe we should try not to attract any attention. Shit, we gotta find him. I know. I really, really want... I really, really like Owen. I want to give him a big hug. I'm glad he isn't dead right now. Hell yeah. Our boy deserved it after being tugged around like a dead body. It's fine, it's fine. Come on, asshole. Man up, it's fine. Maybe I should leave him be. The UGG, I'm so stupid, I'm gonna live up the situation character always ends up in my top three favorites. You get it, Goldie. <laughs> Alright. Let's see. I saved, right? Just wanna make sure. I had to leave for a hot minute. What happened? We're doing Owen's route now. Oh, hey. Alright, we're coming, guys. And now we finally get to do the thing with the rock, with Owen. There's something behind here, but... How are we gonna move this rock? You called? Seriously? <laughs> ha! Yeah! I did it! Wish Luke... The others were here. Yo, he's gay for Lucas, isn't he? So you can impress him with your mess of muscles? I knew they're gay! Everyone's gay and I love it! What are you saying? Hmm, you're very subtle. Oh, like you can talk! Mia, your hair is so beautiful! Your skin is so soft! Whoa, no need for murder eyes. I'll shut up. <sighs> I picked up a rusty key. Oh, always gotta have one of those in games like these, huh? What you gonna say now, bro? I'm telling you, this is some kind of escape the room thing. WLW and MLM solidarity, god fucking bless, hell yeah! With real corpses. They could be fake! Since when are you a, a, a corpse recognizer? A mortician? <laughs> He's so stupid, I love him. Actually, that'd suit you. 
The two friends calling each other out on their gays gayness is my favorite trope. <laughs> I'll stick to psych. I also like psychology as well. I'm not sure if I would major in psych, but I really liked the class I had for that. I've seen skeletons. Well, Claire's not in here. So I guess maybe we won't be seeing Claire this time. Owen has himbo energy and I love him. <laughs> We're gonna get you out of here. Oh. Well. No. No, 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 no! Mia! <laughs> Fuck. It's not fair. Why? Damn it! Who did this to you? We both keep opening our mouths to speak, but nothing comes out. What is there even to say? F in the chat for Mia, again. Should I take her scarf? Yeah, I would assume so, huh? Alright. I carefully unwound Mia's scarf. Let's go. Get up. Her head gonna fall off. Oh, can we not walk past? To go any further, I'd have to step in Mia's... I can't do it. Oh. Okay. She just won't let us go any further. Got it. Okay. Well, let's get going then. Lucas! Your friends? Owen, Freya. You're alive! Buddy! I'm glad to see you both. You're not hurt? Fortunately not. Explore blocked by a corpse. Um, I'm Claire. You must be Owen and Freya? That's right. Well, at least Luca is alive. I'm glad to meet you. And Claire is here. Though I wish the circumstances were better. I don't suppose either of you have any information regarding our situation? Not really. He hasn't asked. I don't want to either. But he must have seen her. Anyway, we are currently searching for an assortment of items to operate a mechanism. We still need something gold and something silver. Have you two seen anything fitting those descriptions? Imagine if Claire called you Mia instead. <laughs> What's that? Something's wriggling. Nope, can't do it. You okay? I thought there might be a clue on the, um, the body, but... Mm. Oh, I know. We just gotta find Lucas. Uh, uh, excuse me, but he's in the room? He doesn't get grossed out by anything. This one time, his cat brought in an entire possum. Nope, nope, nope. It was a happy ending. Allow me to reiterate. Nope. Like how we said, oh, if only Lucas was here when he's like five feet away. It's fine, it's fine. Come on, Asshole Man. Yeah. I left for a bit and now people are here. Yep. And I don't know if he's ignoring me or just deep in thought. Yeah, Mia died again. But at least we got Claire. I'm very sorry for your loss. Should I not have brought it up? No, it's fine. So you saw. When Lucas rec rescued me, she was already... Oh. If there is anything I can do to ease your pain, please give me a hug. No, that is foolish. Of course I cannot. Listen, Claire can be a more than acceptable replacement for Mia. You get it. Thanks anyway. Hey, has Lucas been acting odd at all? Claire's so shady, I love her. <laughs> well, I don't know him very well. He is quite... He is very quiet, and I can't easily read his emotions. Yeah. And all he talks about... Escape. Even though it's not possible. If he keeps up like this, the Sentinels will get really angry. If you even think about escaping, they'll kill you! Well... Never seen that sprite before! 
So is anybody else in the mood to cannibalize Claire because she looks delicious? Jesus Christ, June! That's how I survived. I gave up all hope. I would rather prefer Claire to eat me, not me eat her. How can you live like that? It isn't so bad. Like, if Claire cannibalized me, I'd thank her. At least that's putting my life to good use by giving her sustenance. Why not? Okay. Why can I not go through there? To you. Oh, you're here with me now, not Owen? This room had a puzzle too. A murder mystery. Claire nomming your arm while you're head patting her ASMR. <laughs> You've been busy. I suppose so. I wonder if we were asleep for longer than he was. <laughs> no NSFW in chat, June, please. A thin, dark red mark circles her throat. There are small scratches around it, too. Oh, now we can record our thoughts here, too. Yeah. Okay. The only lewd thing we do is hold hands. Exactly. I took the silver knife. Oh. So the knife was in here first. That ought to work. Shall we return? Lucas. Hmm? Why did Mia die? Are you sure you want me to answer that? Yes. She sacrificed herself to save me. Ooh. Eh. Of course it was something like that. Wait, guys, do you meant eat Claire's arms, nothing else? Yes, exactly. Especially because there's minors in the chat. So please, no NSFW. You were always way too selfless. You didn't even hesitate, did you? But with your scarf with me, <laughs> if I breathe deeply, I can smell you, like you're right here. You're saying something like, just doing my job as a hero, aren't you? Do you wish she had let me die? Yeah, yeah, please. I, I know you're doing it for fun, but yes. Yes, there are children. No NSFW. The only, the only lewd stuff we can do is hold hands, that's it. It's okay, I feel the same. I am grateful that she saved me. And angry that she did so without my consent. But no amount of regret will bring her back. That is the unfortunate truth. I won't regret you, your grief, but I have to keep going. I have to find some way out. Hmm? Oh, shit. Well, looks like Lucas is dying. Oh? What? What the fuck? Come on! <laughs> Whoa, what happened? Monster. Jeez, you okay? I think so, yeah. What a relief. How'd it go? June, you're, you're losing some affection points for me by saying that you don't like tea. I really like tea. We have everything we require. How wonderful! Let's get this done, then. No, we, we saved Lucas, so we're good. Certainly. He's still alive. We still got the boyfriends together. Wow. Everyone's alive in this, except for Mia. Wow. I took the ornate key from the chest. Whoa. It's about the same size as the one we found earlier. That earns more tea for you. <laughs> okay. I'll take your share of the tea then. Nice. 
I suspect I may know where these go. Remember when Mia exists? Neither do I. Only girlfriend is Claire. <laughs> Who's Mia? God. <laughs> However, we need three. Where to start? Perhaps we ought to split up? I like this music. Is that really a good idea? I mean, those things are still around. Actually, it's easier for them to spot large groups. Uh, Lucas, what you doing there? Who's Mia has such who's rum energy? <laughs> as well as who's Joe? Uh, Lucas, what you doing there? I didn't get a chance to inspect this earlier. These may hold some clues. Uh-huh. Looking ex extremely pleased with himself, Lucas handed me a gore-covered key. Okay, Lucas, you might have some problems, but that's okay. We can work on that. Huh. Uh... My goodness. Shall we? Uh, something, something ain't right. Is your boyfriend okay, Owen? Did, did, did you just hit your mic or is my speaker freaking out? I'm not sure. I might have. I might have and just not noticed. I don't know if he's ignoring me or just deep in thought. The one time Joe Mama isn't in chat. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. I have always wondered what lies beyond that door. Hopefully the exit. Somehow, I don't think it will be so easy. He would be with us, but he contracted Ligma. <laughs> no way. It's barred from the other side. What? Do we have two or one key now? We did all that for nothing? I did warn you. What do you mean you warned us? <laughs> what's Ligma, Barn? <laughs> Sigh, what's Ligma? Ligma. <laughs> God damn it. Ligma ice cream cone. There we go. What do you mean? You warned us. You continue to assert that there's no way out. Yes, I'm sorry. But, but what's the point then? Would you supposed to die in here? I... Mia. What? We need Mia. She can get over and remove that bar. She's dead, Freya! She's not... You saw her, Freya. She's gone. Ugh. Oh yes, an excellent plan indeed. Brute force, always a winner. Shut up! Just shut up! This doesn't make sense, though. Until now, the puzzles have been solvable. It doesn't have to make sense! I've committed the ultimate bamboozle. You did, Varn. Thank you. None of this has made any sense whatso fucking ever. Why should it start now? There must be some pattern. Some logic. For fuck's sake, Lucas! Those two certainly are lively and gay. I've never seen them blow up at each other like this, having a lover's spat. Not that I blame them. Hmm. What do you think? I think we should date. <laughs> huh? What do I... The boyfriends are fighting. <laughs> About all this. What's going on? Who set it all up and why? Uh, oh, um, the truth is, I haven't really thought about it. Did he just say the F word? Let Owen say fuck. <laughs> I like how you slipped in that confession in the end there. <laughs> I figured out pretty quickly that trying to escape gets you killed. Right. Gah! We're never gonna get out of here, are we? Owen, why can't you shove Claire in there? Get up there, Claire. She's too dainty, we can't have her do that. Uh, you guys can just keep thinking. Just wake me up when it's over. Ooh, I like this. Are oh, they holding hands? The boys are holding hands. I'm sorry. Huh? For letting Mia die. If I hadn't. It's too late now. I'm 
sorry too, for yelling. I just, I hate this. We need to get out of here. Please give me your number. I am but a desperate gay. Let me break the door down. <laughs> right? This whole CG is just gay. It is. I'm gonna die and I can't do anything about it. Is this it then? Is this as far as we can go? I'm sorry, everyone. I swear. I'll find a way to save you. No matter how many times we have to die. And then we starve to death. Loosen in. Right, so that's... I assume this is Owen's because it lit up. Be trapped with Claire forever. <laughs> what should I do? What's with this intense aura? Hmm? Oh, you're back. She was asleep? <laughs> so, how does this work exactly? Very well. It would hardly be fair if I didn't give you some explanation. It's time for Freya's ultimate technique. Return by death. Be gay till you starve. This really do be just re-zero, isn't it? I'm gonna die so I can go back and save you. You are aware you can use the diaries behind me to return to the other world, yes? When you return to the very beginning, using the blue book, the entire world is reset. Well, of course, you alone retain your memories. But anything you changed will be returned to its original state, including any untimely deaths. The other books are a little more complicated. They record a snapshot of the world as it was when you wrote in them. Any items you have retrieved, any puzzles you have solved, remain so when you return there. Nice! Not gonna lie, my Tenma is also pretty cute, like I'm just simping for everybody in this game. <laughs> I just hope Freya doesn't have to go through episode 15. <laughs> By the way, can you see which parts are lit up on the posts? Because my eyesight is shit. Yeah, it's hard. I, I think I can see, like, one on the yellow is lit up, possibly. On the real, though, I'm obsessed with ReZero. It's so good, and I will die on this hill until everyone knows of its greatness. Endless 8. Vet weaves will know. Ah! No, June! No. No. I do not want to... <laughs> This is not like Endless 8. I will not let it be like Endless 8. <laughs> June, thank you for the 550 bits. <laughs> Thanks for dealing with me. I'll always deal with you, June. I love you. No homo. Naturally, there may come a time where you wish to overwrite such a world. But it is not to your liking. In that case, merely return to the beginning. And one more thing. If you decide to rest and take a break... You'll be returned to your last diary entry, so do be careful. Got it, I think. Alright. Let's look at all of these people being happy for once before we kill them. Gay. Yes, homo. <laughs> Alright. So, should we keep going with Owen's route and have him die again, possibly? Or should we do, um... What is the, what is his name? Uh, Lucas? Should we do Lucas? What do you mean no homo? We're literally playing retrace. What do you mean no homo? You're right. At least three whole homos. <laughs> All right. Yes. Would. <laughs> All right. I guess. I guess we'll do. Oh, I want to see his dead body. Okay. Let's do Owen then. Okay. So it should be this. We get four and we have a deal. Or wait. I'm guessing. Hmm. I don't know. I'm here for the gore. Of course you are. What page should I go to? The library. Alright. It worked. I'm back. I have to do everything again. Come on, brain. Cooperate with me here. It's fine. I can do it. Just keep thinking of Mia, Owen, and Lucas. I can't let them down. We still haven't seen Lucas die. So, I'm a little bit... Hmm. What's up? I was thinking one of these might be a secret lover. Yep, yep, yep. Take... Oh, I already got the key. Okay. 
don't think I need to touch this again. Okay, thank you for letting me skip the puzzles. These are no books. Goldie gets two boyfriends and a very short girlfriend for the low price of Owen's dead body. <laughs> yeah, let's steal that necklace. Alright. Are you ready to die again, bro? Yeah. Okay, he's ready to die again. <laughs> Chat. <laughs> you guys are funny. Okay, don't got the right key for that. Come on, baby, I'm sorry. Okay, so we're back here again. Alright. Wait, what all items do I have actually? Just unlock that. He's turning, but the door won't budge. Aw, oh, come on. Wanted to look around in there some more. You bet your sweet bippy. <laughs> I'm living with the consequences. Alright. Let's see. Record my thoughts. At least we get to listen to Owen's sweet thing before he dies again. No good. Don't got the right key. Oh yeah, right. We go down here. See Mia's dead body. All right, we're coming, guys. All right. Well, you ready to see her dead body again? Are you excited? Well, let's move this over here first. E e e. Picked up a rusty key. Let me out, let me out. Bro, can you not be in my way? Thank you. No, 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 no. Yep. Yes. This is reality. Should I take her scarf? What happens if we don't take the scarf is my question. Can't do it. Let's go. Get up. Let's see what happens if we don't take the scarf. Maybe my dude will be like, hey, I'm not gonna do anything to you because you don't have a scarf. Lucas. Oh, your friends? Oh, and Freya. I'm glad to see you both. You're not hurt? Fortunately not. Um, I'm clear. You must be Owen and Freya. That's right. I'm glad to meet you. If Mage Giselle asked for my soul, I would offer it and anything to go along with it, so, as I, to surprise to the surprise of absolutely goddamn no one. Worship Maid Zazelle. Hell yeah. Spam the Maid Zazelle in chat. We stan her. Love her. Best girl. I risk the consequences. No surprise. Information? Not really. He hasn't asked, and I don't want to either. But he must have seen her. Looking for an assortment of items. Looking for gold. Maybe we shouldn't talk to him then? I'm very sorry. E. Okay. Has Lucas been acting odd at all? Well, I don't know him very well. He is very quiet, and I can't easily read his emotions. Yeah. That's how I survived. I gave up all hope. Can you live like that? It isn't so bad. Alright. Now, let's do 
not talk to Lucas, shall we? Record my thoughts. I'm done. After you. Took the silver knife. It's not to work. Shall we return? Lucas. Hmm? Why did Mia die? Are you sure you want me to answer that? Yes. Sacrificed yourself. Of course it was something like that. You were always way too selfless. You didn't even hesitate, did you? To throw away your life for someone like him? Look at him. He's not even sad. How can he be so cold? Doesn't he know he's the reason you're dead? Maybe he has problems expressing his emotions. Freya? If it weren't for him, you'd still be here. Freya? I guess we're killing Lucas now! I'm not happy about this either, believe me. Hmm. What option do we choose? Yandere Freya hype, let's go! Why not? She has left me with a debt I can never repay. And she was my friend, as are you and Owen. I don't have time to grieve for her when I have you two to worry about. Now, can we move on? Hmm? Bye! Freya? <laughs> uh, Freya, are you okay? And where's Lucas? He was a monster. N no! Oh no, if I lose my girlfriend, you also lose your boyfriend, Owen. Oh no. Damn it, I can't take it. I'm sorry, Freya. I can't, I can't do this. It's okay. Hey, Freya? Yeah? What happened to him? He... Oh... Oh no! Uh, Freya has Claire now too, and Owen just... Uh... Oh boy. I'm gonna lie between my teeth. Because he did not sacrifice himself for me. There was no conversation between me and him. I just left without his ass. He did? That's... Uh, I shouldn't be too surprised. Freya be sacrificing Lucas to Maid Zizel for eternity with Claire. <laughs> I know he seems cold, but he's really a good person, you know? Was, I guess. Um. Apparently, the words they sacrifice themselves for me seems to make people go yandere. <laughs> oh, hey, Claire. Sorry, I didn't want to interrupt. Um, I'm really sorry about your friend. <laughs> it's not like it's your fault. I suppose. I think that the Sentinels would leave the dungeon to pursue him, though. They don't normally? No, but he has had a strong will to escape. They're attracted to that. So if we give up on leaving, they won't kill us? Yes, exactly. I'm so glad you understand. Are you giving up? I would have just told the truth, but hey, Freya's already being a jerk, so why not? <laughs> you got a better idea? Aw, baby. Time to get motivated and give up. I don't want to die, and I don't want you to die. The best way to do that is just chill here, I guess. Maybe someone will come save us. Yeah, let's starve to death for the third time. It really isn't so bad here, you know. Here, why don't you rest for a little while? I'll keep watch. This must be... You must be exhausted after everything that has happened. Also, I'm sorry I used Owen's voice for Claire for a second. Pretty sleepy. Hey, maybe it's just a nightmare that I'm about to wake up. Just gonna close my eyes for a minute. I'm tired too, but I don't want to give, give up. I want to get out of here. I can't let it end like this. 
All right, we got Owen's end. Well, I think I preferred the other, the Lucent end, because that got at least him out with his boyfriend, but okay. So is that all filled out, I think, perhaps? What about ends? Think of them as markers of your progress in this world. See the jewels? Yeah, they will end. Except for the left hand one, of course. That one records what's of your companions you have entered the world with. So, how do I get these ends? Simple, you must reach a point where you can no longer move forward. The name of the end is determined by which companions you are with at the time, usually. There are a few special ones. They won't affect your progress. Consider them an amusement. And why are they called ends instead of endings? Well, not that it was my idea, but I believe it is to ensure you do not think you are actually finished. Yeah, I get that part. So, for now, I'll just keep trying different paths. Alright. So then. I'm guessing... So we did Mia. And we did Owen. So let's do Lucas now. Okay. I feel really bad because Lucas's death is just completely because Freya didn't want to help him. <laughs> yeah, Freya, that kind of wasn't very... Wasn't very chill of you. Alright. Let's... <laughs> after what happened... <laughs> this is kind of awkward after what just happened with you and me. But, yeah. Are you really about to finish the whole game in one stream? Well, I think there's not that much time left of the game. It's pretty short to get the stream... Or, get the ending, so... I'm gonna try and get all of the endings. It worked. I'm back. I have to do everything again. Come on, brain. Cooperate with me here. It's fine. I can do this. Just keep thinking of Mia, Owen, and Lucas. Can't let them down. <laughs> that wasn't very poggers of you, Freya. Alright, let's save. Record my thoughts. All done. Okay, Lucas. Hopefully I don't kill you again. Maybe it's a secret testing facility for the physically gifted? Owen is uncannily good at guessing my thoughts. Uh, were you just planning on doing this one game for the stream tonight, or are you doing another game as well? I was thinking of doing another game as well. I guess we'll see how it goes as I get through this. You know, these are Owen's favorite flower? I do know. Perhaps we could... I took the sunflower. What's this say? A newspaper clip. Oh, we can finally read this now. A newspaper clipping. Five people poisoned in closed room mystery. The bodies were discovered by a waiter at midday. The cause of death has been determined to be a cyanide-laced cake eaten by the five victims. <laughs> uh, hi, Lucas. <laughs> it's nice to see you alive and, like, not dead because of, well, us being salty. The following statements were collected from witnesses on the day of the crime. Alex has complained about Emma and Celia arguing loudly that morning. Bianca had said that Alex was acting strangely all day. Celia was gossiping that she just so happened to see Alex and Daniel sneaking off together this morning. Daniel hadn't said anything of particular interest to any of the witnesses. Emma mentioned to security that she saw a woman skulking around the kitchen that morning, but didn't see her face. Freya holding Lucas's hand right after leaving him to die? More likely than you think. <laughs> and underneath, there's a letter. Please ensure the entrance can be opened from within the false tomb. Payment will be delivered upon completion of construction. How oh, intriguing. If one of these tombs is fake, there might be a way out of this room inside it. But how do we know which one that could be? Hmm. Perhaps one of the poisoning victims was not poisoned at all. It was merely faking their death. Presumably, the only one who could do that would be the culprit. Wouldn't someone notice before burying them? A bribe to the coroner and a closed casket funeral can hide a number of sins. In any case, it seems prudent to continue on the assumption that the culprit faked their death somehow. So, I just need to figure out who the culprit is. Alright. Marking of an eight-pointed star. Huh? There's a hole behind it. Should I put something in? Yeah. 
Go tell Mia you love her, since I'll probably wind up too. Mia. I'll leave a note. Bea is here. Okay. So, let's see. Here rests Alex. There's a keyhole here. Okay, so these are all the people. Here rests Bianca. Celia. Emma. Daniel. Okay. Okay, uh, you didn't happen to unearth an ancient conspiracy. Okay, are uh, you like a fucking conspiracy theorist, dude? Like you posted on Reddit? Whoa. Who even needs this many keys? Off topic, but I love MC's RPG AU design so much. I can't stop looking at them. <laughs> Someone with a lot of blocks. Rhetorical. Sorry. You kind of have a point. Maybe there's something useful behind one of these locks? I took the caretaker's keys. Alright, so let's see. Because we're out of truth, then it couldn't have been Alex or Daniel. Celia's statement also suggests the two were involved. I find it unlikely one would poison the other. I believe we can safely rule out those two. So it's down to the three women. Indeed. Let me see. So let's check out some dead bodies. Hell yeah. Okay, so we got Iris Alex. No. It's not Alex. We got Bianca. I'm thinking it's either Bianca or Celia. Celia? No. Wonder if examining them gets me to muse about them a bit more. Emma. I don't think it's Emma. So let's see. Looks like I complained about Emma and Celia arguing loudly. Bianca had said that Alex was acting strangely all day. Celia was gossiping that she just so happened to see Alex and Daniel. Daniel had something. Emma mentioned to security she saw a woman. Inca, Celia, and Emma. So we know that Celia and Emma had some kind of disagreement with each other. And that there was a confrontation that morning. I don't see any reason for Alex to lie about that. And yet their statements are in agreement that neither of the men were involved. Curious. I'm only thinking Emma because of the flowers on her casket. Curious. If we're assuming Emma is telling the truth, then the only remaining suspects are Celia and Bianca. Celia, stop being a snitch. They're sneaking out to hold hands. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> hmm. Something has caught my eye. It's hardly damning evidence, but... Should I interrupt him? I'm talk. We can say with almost total certainty that the culprit is not Alex. If that is the case, then why would Bianca have said something to cast suspicion on him? Oh, you're right. Isn't she the only one that's not supportive of that? Maybe she was mistaken? Perhaps, but it leaves her as the odd one out. Hers is the only statement that does not fit with the other four, or, th or three, discounting Daniel. With that said, my conclusion is the culprit is Bianca. You sure? About 95%. Good enough for me, I guess. Yeah, that sounds about right. Now let's do Bianca. Looks like this will fit. Yes! He's smart. He is. I guess reading all those conspiracy theories online be giving him a big brain. Hmm? Felt like there was some resistance. Hmm. Let's just keep turning it. Freya. No! Ugh! Did I just die? Oh. Well, shit. Well. Oh? Okay. Well. Well, 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 well. Look what we have here. I knew it was Celia the Snitch. <laughs> Alright. Cecilia, then. 
Is this Celia? Yeah. The key. Oh, I gotta get the keys first. Time to redo that. Oh, who even needs this many keys? I was thinking that one was bad, considering that's where your friend's body was found in every other timeline. That's valid as well. That's probably how Owen died. Yep. Yeah. Where's Celia? Yeah, that makes sense. That makes total sense why that would be a bad end then. It's kind of stiff. Uh, oh. Oh! Does that mean Lucas could have killed Owen? Perhaps. I hope not. Okay. Well, that one didn't have an option when I turned it, but this one did. Hold on. Okay. Sounded like it was probably an accident. Yeah. And then he went into despair. Hmm. I love how we're just constantly trying. I think it's still this one because there was another option. And the other one didn't have an option. Not yet. Something wrong. No, I just... Someone was there? Well done. Thanks. But why is this even here? Lucas, focus. Hmm? Oh, yes, I don't know. You're kinda suspicious, my guy. I have theories, but nothing concrete. Post your Reddit thread then, my man. Just follow me, okay? Yeah, come on, bro, we gotta be in this together. I do hope it's aliens. He's fucking a conspiracy theorist, dude. He fucking posts on Reddit all day. God damn, Lucas. Okay. BRB, I'm gonna go to the store real fast. Uh, it stinks in here. Hey, is that... Huh. What are you doing? Throat. Finger marks on neck. Not good. No shit, Sherlock! <laughs> it's a dead body, Lucas. Er, yes, that aside, it would take incredible strength to inflict these kinds of injuries. If someone like that were to attack us, let's just hurry up and find the others, okay? Then we can get out of here. Wherever here is. All right, record my thoughts. Hmm, deep in thought as always. No good, doesn't look like I've got the right key for this. Okay, so we can't go down and see Mia's dead body yet. Great up there is probably big enough to fit through. No way to get up to it though. Hmm. Maybe if I balance on Lucas's shoulders? He's pretty tall. Should I ask him? Yeah, why not? Hey Lucas, give me a hand. Give me a hand up. You cannot be serious. This'll work. Assuming I couldn't even support your weight. Hey! The heaviest thing I have recently carried as a laptop. You fucking... God. God. I'm kind of surprised Owen doesn't drag you to the gym. He has. Multiple times. Each no more pleasant than the last. Anyway, my combined heights will only barely reach. If you're certain about this, I will help. But I think it's a bad idea. I already saved. So, let's do it. If I die, I die. Lucas is a twink. <laughs> you won't know if I don't try. You spend too much time with Mia. Very well. Let's get it over with. Alright, so if you kind of kneel down. So close. Please hurry. I'm trying. 
No, I can't get the grate open. Freya. Ah. A great fall end. Wow. Lucas, uh, Lucas has a lot of bad ends, doesn't he? Let's go to the lobby. Wow. She just died. Okay. Okay. Who's there? Stay right there. Is it the culprit? It's gotta be. Yo, let me see the maid. Slow down and tell us what's going on. Oh, please, you have to help us. I'll do anything for the maid. My sister, my sister is. Hmm, interesting. Please, you have to help us find the culprit. Okay, sure. Oh, thank you. Not like today can get any weirder. Just talking to some shadow folks. Can barely even see them. I can't believe this. Hmm. What happened? I was attending to the sisters from around o'clock. Both the younger sister and the butler left at around 1.30, but I stayed there. Someone has to do the actual work around here. The younger sister returned at about 1.40. There was a massive earthquake around 1.50, I think. <laughs> Dog and Rumpa music begins. I managed to get the lights back on, and when I did... Imagine being Lucas and like your friend died because you were too weak. Sacrifice me to Maid Zizel and beg for the crumb of food from her table. I would do that. I'm sorry. Please, allow me to compose yourself. Yo, compose yourself all you want, as long as I get to look at you. Alibi? So, at 150. The only ones here were you and the younger sister? I. What? You can't seriously be suspecting me. No, calm down. I don't suspect you, baby. I'm just trying to figure out what happened. Hmm. Well, I guess I don't have a choice. You're right that it was just the two of us. But I swear, I didn't do it. I never. I would never do that to my mistress. I believe you. She always showed me such kindness. I can never betray her. A likely story. Hey, don't don't you don't you be saying rude things to the maid. Shush. You get it, Freya. If it wasn't you, then could it have been her sister? Mm, they had been quarreling recently. But I could hear her playing piano the whole time. The maid is being shady as fuck. No, June, don't don't say that. The maid, I, I trust the maid with my life. And what were you doing? Attending to my mistress, of course. She was feeling poorly, so I was giving her my full attention. I wish you'd give me your full attention. Hmm, that's enough. Hmm. Hmm. How may I help you? What happened? I was attending to the sisters from one o'clock. At 1.30, I took a brief break for sustenance. There was an earthquake at 1.50, so I returned to the parlor. When I got there, the elder sister was already... Hmm. So, they're sisters. So, these two are sisters. Yes, the piano player is the younger. The maid is gonna kill you? I'd let her kill me. Were they close? I had observed them quarreling recently, however, I can say with certainty that the younger sister is a gentle, peaceful girl. She would not have committed this crime. And in saying so, you accuse your co-worker. I suppose I do. Hmm. Alright. I'll punt that bear off a roof for Maid Zizella, you get it. Hmm. You wanna talk to me? I'll do my best. Hey guys, I guess I'm not going to the store for a while, so it'll take a while for me to get you Dr. Pepper, June. <laughs> I have some Pepsi at my house, June, if you want to come over. I was rehearsing between 1 o'clock and 1.30. All maids are queens, which is a strange role reversal, but that's just how we do. Hell yeah. They serve the queens, but they're the real queens. Then I took a break. How long for? About 10 minutes? 
But it's weird. When I came back, my piano wasn't working properly. Huh. I thought that was the worst thing that would happen today. Hmm. You play, play, you play piano? Indeed. Such a lovely instrument, don't you think? Hmm. The maid and butler. The maid is incredibly nice and kind and wonderful, isn't she? Oh, yes. Our butler is so talented and attentive. I'm very fortunate. What about the maid? Uh, well, she was my sister's attendant, not mine. I suppose she's fine. Hmm. That's all for now. <sighs> Thin, dark red mark circles around her fur. There's small scratches around it, too. Two o'clock. So, we would have been. It might not be accurate. Maid Zazel cleans your house and insults your interior decorating skills. ASMR. I would also listen to that, Goldie. Okay, guys, you can cancel me if you like, but I actually don't like Dr. Pepper, like, at all. Am I still valid? Your tastes are valid, Hagu. I like Dr. Pepper, but it's okay. Is the mistress str strangled with piano wire? Oh. That might be what happened, June. Very smart. This tells us that the sister was murdered shortly at before 2 o'clock. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay, I can't, I can't accuse you, apparently. Fancy knife. Is this real silver? The butler's giving me a suspicious look. I should leave it for now. It feels like she's watching me. Ugh, all the hairs on my arms are standing up. She doesn't look like anyone in here. I wonder who she is. Alright. There's a string missing. Looks like it was snipped cleanly off. Can I not save here now? Damn. That sucks. Okay. No good. Doesn't look like I got the right key for this. Uh, I can. Alibi? So, at 150, the only ones here were you and the younger sister. I- what? You can't be suspecting me. I'm just trying to figure out what happened. Well, I guess I don't have a choice. It's just the two of us. That's why I didn't do it. Never do that to my mistress. You showed me kindness, can't betray her. It wasn't you, your sister. They've been quarreling recently. I could hear her playing piano the whole time. Aren't piano wires actually sharp enough to cut? Yes, they are. They're extremely dangerous. I remember that because there have been multiple horror RPGs that have areas with piano wires that can kill you. <laughs> and what were you doing? Tending to my mistress? Feeling poorly? Hmm. Maybe... Hmm. So they're sisters. Apparently doesn't have an alibi. Um, about the oh, we got a new one. There's a wire missing in your piano. What? But why? Who would do that? I guess that's why it sounded strange. More importantly, where's that wire right now? Is it around her neck? Small scratches. Piano classics. Sounds like your kind of music, Lucas. Gives you that impression. Well, you never sing karaoke. I figured you must be into something classier. Singing is embarrassing. If you must know, I like pop punk. Hmm. I'm gonna pick that. It only took mortal danger to get him to admit that. Mates? Or maybe she was planning to kill... Uh, maybe the sister was planning to kill her in the first place. My sweet sister, how will I go on? She's ignoring me. Oh, shoot. Press the window key. Oops. Can I help you? Okay. Very well. Can't believe this. Alright. That's one of you. Okay, I can't. Alright. So let's see. I don't think there's anything else I can do in this room right now, right? I think I have exhausted all my dialogue. Hello! We wouldn't play if something is wrong. Is string missing? I think it's the sister.
sister. I think the sister is the one that killed her. Talk to Lucas? Oh, right. How's it going? Well, I know how she died. She was strangled, probably by some kind of thin string. That's a good start. Next step is finding the murder weapon. You know an awful lot about this, Lucas. Strangulation is a fairly popular method in murder mysteries. Okay. I have an idea about the murder weapon. Oh? Yeah, there's a wire missing from the piano. That certainly fits our criteria. Apparently, it went missing while the sister was on her break. Sometime between 1.30 and 1.40. Assuming she's telling the truth. I'm ready to make an accusation. Very well. Everyone, the detective has an announcement. I'm calling the maid and the piano string is the weapon. I'm calling the sister and the piano string is the weapon. The maid would never do anything wrong. I believe in her. Well, who was it? It was the sister. So Aurora sighed. A heinous crime to be sure. Yeah, how dare you insult a maid, Zune. It wasn't me! I was playing my piano the whole time! You heard me, right? Well, I did. Did you? At the time of the murder, the piano was missing a string. She said she noticed something was amiss when she was playing. Shit, guys. Elio is biased. We need to pick for him. <laughs> but you stated that you didn't notice anything strange. Clearly, she has no ear for music. Or maybe you use the record player to cover the absence of your music. Hmm. Maybe my bias is w working and helping me. Hmm. And the sound of you strangling your own sister. This is an outrage. You, how could you? Shut up, it wasn't me. It could only have been you. No, no. No. <laughs> the door. Shall we? Just give me a moment. Very well. I got it right, didn't I? So why? What's done is done. We need to go find the others. Right. How dare you! Okay. Fancy knife. Let's check out that door first, though. Why not? Let me just go. Okay. Uh, forgive me. I'll follow your lead. Oh, no. Well, look at what we got here. This boy just keeps on dying. Whoa, what happened in here? More bodies, too. Oh, no. It was both of them. Wait, those clothes. No, 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 no. Can't be. Both of them died. Wow, in the same room. Well. Took the librarian's keys, let me see, so I keep that if I come back here from the void. Chunks of flesh has been torn away, exposing muscles and bones. Here, entrails spilling from between ribs. Here, a flash of teeth under a mangled cheek. Why are all my children dying? <laughs> They're almost unrecognizable. Almost. I retrieved Mia's scarf and Owen's ring. The blood's still warm. So they died recently. All the books can't be bothered. Beautiful golden necklace just begging to be taken. Might as well. Are they that bad at the river puzzle? <laughs> God. Come on, guys. Haven't you guys played RPG Maker horror games? Mia has died four times, and I think Owen has died three. Nice. Look at all this death. And then Lucas has only died once. Should I give him Owen's ring? Yeah, why not? Why? 
You were his best friend. You should have it. Uh, I think the charm you were looking for is his boyfriend, actually, Freya. No, I mean, why? Why did this happen? What did we do wrong? What could we have done different? There wasn't anything. There must have been. Yeah, best friend. Damn it. Mm, let's get out of here. And how do you propose to do that? To be fair, you didn't see Lucas's body. Could have survived somehow. I don't know, but we can't stay here. They wouldn't want that. So I'm going to get both of us out of here. Got it? Yes. Okay, let's go. I guess the, the ending divergence is will make them pay as compared to let's get out of here. Best friend is how my sister referred to her GF when around our parents. But parents aren't here, so what are you doing, Freya? Okay, the gore with the long black hair. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, forgive me. I'll follow your lead. at the end, my bro. It's the end of this route. How you feeling? Mm. Deep in thought, as always. No good. No good. Freya, yeah? Uh, what's that? Lucas handed me a gore-covered key. I double-checked the corpses in this room. This was hidden inside. Did we not find Claire this time? No, we did not. Why did you do that? I was hoping for some insight into our enemy. So you went digging around inside a corpse? It's fine, I'm wearing gloves. Although I still need a new pair after this. Now, shall we try this key? It worked? It seems we need two more though. All right. Good. There we go. All right, now we can go down here. Well, Mia's body's not gonna be down here. Maybe we'll find Claire now? Oh, well, we found her. Well, that was because we didn't go down here before. Unfortunately, I, saw, I see no way of accessing it. We could push the rock out of the way. Don't look at me like that. We have to try. Don't. What? Oh, I wasn't. I was just thinking. It's stupid. Just say it. If Owen... He would have done it easily. Then try to show off by picking me up or something. Like I said, it's stupid. Uh, I knew he was gonna say something about Owen. There she be. Hello. Hello? Oh, hello. Forgive me, I was so surprised to see another person here. It's okay. Let me see if I can get you out of here. Locked, obviously. None of these keys fit. Maybe there's another one around here somewhere. I need keys. Don't you just love sacrificing your friends to get some keys to get out? Don't you love splitting relationships? Boy, how fun! I know, right? Another body. Were they trying to hide? There's no book here this time. Now these look about the right size. Picked up a set of keys. Can we go over here? We can. Let's get the rope. I don't have time to look at this. Be useful. Am I gonna... Am I gonna say anything about the note we left? Guys, guys, I got 6.9 points. Nice. So let's get our girl Claire out. Ah, you really did it. Yeah. Um, I'm 
clear. Freya. Thank you for freeing me, Freya. And this is... Lucas. Mm. I am glad to meet you both, but I'm sorry as well. To think yet more people would be trapped in this place. Not for long. What? We're getting out of here. You intend to escape? Yes. Uh... What? It's just, I don't believe that will be possible. No one has ever left this place. What about its creator? What? There must be someone overseeing all of this. I... I don't know. I haven't seen anything like that. I'm sorry. Huh, what are we going to do? None of this makes sense. What am I supposed to do? I can't think. I can't... Is he... Sorry, just give us a second. Please, take all the time you need. Sorry. It's cool. No, it isn't. I should control myself better. She doesn't believe in escape because she doesn't want to summon the creatures to kill her girlfriend and her GF's friend. <laughs> we stand. Why? We're stuck in some kind of hell world. Our best friends are dead and there may not be a way out. That's not a good reason to con lose control. Anyway, I think I'm just gonna sit here and cry for a bit. Then we can figure out what to do next. Okay? Okay. It's no use. There's no way the two of us can escape together. Without those two, there's nothing to pull us out of the darkness. Oh shit, oh. Lucas, you feel the same, don't you? Hi, I'm Claire, and this is my girlfriend Freya, and Freya's girlfriend Mia. <laughs> With Temna, I'm ready. Lucas end. All right, so we got Lucas's end now. What should I do? Let's talk. Why am I the only one who needs to come, who comes back? I am not the one you need to ask. But I mean, Mia would be way better. Or even Lucas or Owen. And yet here you are. Yep. Okay. So I think we just got this one end left. I took Lucas's hand and woke up in the mausoleum. I'm still not sure. If we... Hold on. Not this one. Let me go back and check out what we got so far in the... In here. So we got Mia's end. We got that, that one Lumen end or whatever. Owen end. And Lucas end. Was there... Still haven't gotten Claire's end yet. Because I read in the guide that there's a clear end. So yeah, let me see. Let me go through my guide that I have here that June gave me. Let's see. So we got... Let me look at the ones I got. So we got Lucas end. And Lumia. Is that... This seems to be a Lucas root thing. So let's do Lumia end. Yeah, we ended up not getting to clear end, so maybe don't close your eyes when she asks you to. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay. Well, for now, let's do the Lumia end, and we'll save Claire for last, because she's best girl. Alright. So let's see. Alright, with the green blue, select mausoleum. Ow! Uh, Freya, are you... No time to chat. Grab those keys. Uh, yes, okay. There isn't a single moment to waste. Here. Look us through the caretaker's key, is that me? Okay. Grab the flowers. I grab that there's no time to waste. Interact with the middle. Here is Bianca. This is it. Well done. Hurry up. Coming. Are you actually gonna be able to save them this time if we're going super fast? Record my thoughts. Oh, 
What do we have here? Do that later. Hmm? Just follow me. Right, yes. Lead the way. Who's there? Stay right there. Is it the culprit? It's gotta be. Slow down and tell us what's going on. Oh, please, you have to help us. My sister. My sister is... Hmm, interesting. Please, you have to help us find the culprit. Fine. I've done this before. You probably just go up to the culprit and accuse them. That person was... The sister. I don't have time to talk to them. Should I accuse the sister? Yeah. The sister did it. Freya has become every speedrunner mashing through unskippable dialogue. <laughs> what? Okay, done. Open the door now. But... I know. I'm right, so just do it. Yes, at once. God, please let me have made it in time. Okay. I really need to look at this again. Freya! Ah, oh, yeah, we made it before they died. Nice. Owen, don't touch that! Fuck. No! Owen! I have to move. I have to get everyone out of here. What should I do? Record my thoughts. Um. Fuck, what do I do? Owen, Owen! Lucas, we have to go. Not without him! Lucas! He's already... No! Come on! Straight. Go! Idiot, I'm not going anywhere! <laughs> Owen just always dies. Don't close your eyes! Stay with me! Let go! No! Owen, I'm so sorry. No, this isn't fair! Why did he have to die? At least we survived. How can you say that? The gayness is slowing them down. Shit, what do we do? <laughs> Our friend is dead because of me. I should have died instead. Don't be stupid. You're always doing this. Do you have any idea how much it hurts? Think about the people we have to live, who have to live with that burden. Knowing you sacrificed yourself, how can you think any of us would be okay with that? Freya. What am I saying? She doesn't remember any of it. And she won't remember this either. Freya's right. Not you too. You can sit here and sulk if that's what you want. I won't bring him back. And while I am aware, revenge will be no more effective. It will at least give me some small satisfaction. This is the best I can hope for now. Revenge on who? And how? We don't know anything about this place. Then that is where we should start. Who done it? How done it? Why done it? These are the factors we must consider. Freya had enough of everyone's shit and is going insane at the same time. She really is becoming Subaru. <laughs> we should start with who done it. I don't suppose either of you have any mortal enemies. Is that supposed to be a joke? Yes. It's okay. I thought it was funny. <laughs> really, Lucas? I misread the room again. My apologies. <laughs> I really like Lucas. <laughs> anyway, I'll take that as a no. Mm, I can't draw any conclusions on this just yet. So then, how about the how done it? How much would it even cost to set up something like this? It would indeed require a great deal of wealth. If Claire confesses to her and she says, I love Mia, I'm going to scream. <laughs> Not to mention those people from before. Method acting is one thing, but to convince them to murder each other. So then, what about why done it? Twice now, Ray and I have had to solve logic puzzles in order to advance. I have no doubt that if we had failed, there would have been consequences, possibly fatal. And that thing Owen was fiddling with, I think it was a puzzle too. So, our perpetrator is not averse to killing. But that is not their primary goal. Otherwise, we would already be dead. Some kind of test, then? That would make sense. But even after we solved the magpie puzzle... No, wait. We hadn't solved all the puzzles. This one had been destroyed. Could we have prevented that somehow? So then... Is that 
everything? I guess that's a start. So, the next step is to find out what other puzzles there are. If we do that, it should bring us closer to our enemy. Alright. Let's go then. Clear my thoughts. Locked. Hmm. Try this. Lucas handed me a gore covered key. Are you going to ask where I found this? Do I want to know? I love Lucas so, so much. I also love Owen a lot. He's such a good boy. Also Mia, she's precious. Very, very good girl. And Claire is just best girl. And Freight is just so good too. They're all so good. I love them so much. Why can't they all stay alive for once? I hope we can get an end where everyone is alive. Okay, point. One down. An awful lot of locked doors in this place. I suppose one of them must lead to our salvation. Do you think so? It must. Else, I fear I will be unable to keep going. Even I. No, never mind. <sighs> so maybe we have to solve every single puzzle to get the keys and get out. But since they share half a brain cell, they just keep failing. Faye is going insane. Great. You wanna go back in there? I am. Um, thought I saw a set of keys in there. Oh yeah, we found some. They're. Owen took them. So we're stuck. That's right, it was locked last time too. What? Oh, uh, nothing. W wait, be quiet for a sec. You heard that, right? Yeah, sound like someone's squishing around. Yeah. Um, maybe we can try again later. There's always a way around. Mia, don't worry about me, okay? You guys are right. We have to keep going. Alright. I will follow your lead. It's not like you. And I would not call you a natural leader. And in this place, it seems to suit you perfectly. Hmm. What? No, it's nothing. I knew I should have learned how to pick locks. You were planning to learn? Yeah, it seemed like a handy skill, you know, in case Dad changes the locks or something. I never got around to it. Well, maybe I could learn now. Child by fire. You have hairpins, right? Mm-hmm. All right, leave it to me. Stairs, maybe? Wait, no. No way. It's locked, yeah? Okay. So, what do I do now? I guess, do I just keep examining until she gets it? I guess I just gotta keep examining it. Until she gets it. Whoops. See. Took the oh, here's a silver knife. Okay. Mm -hmm. Try by fire, as they say. Maybe she'll learn eventually. Yeah. I don't think she will though. Okay. So I got the knife now. Flowers, a knife, and a key. I really don't want to look at this any more than I have to. It's just a body, an object. Hmm. What? Oh, nothing. What? Why is this one locked? We did leave in an awful hurry. Perhaps when it slammed shut after us, it relocked itself? You've got to be kidding me. No good. Everything's locked. We must be missing something. And that doesn't make sense. If there is no way for us to succeed, then what is the point? 
Some kind of sick game that cannot be won. Someone might still come rescue us, right? Or maybe one of those doors will open. We should just hold tight. We can't give up hope. Mia. <laughs> you say that so easily. Have we really reached a dead end? A dead end. That's it. I have to go find another path. Athena, I'm ready. Freya? W what's happening? I'm sorry. But there's no other way. What are you talking about? No! I see. This is the answer, isn't it? Come on! Weren't you two just saying we have to keep going? Also, there he is. There's your plague doctor that you were missing so much, Goldie. What about Owen? I'm going to save him. What? What do you mean? Not just him. All of you. I'll see you again, okay? Freya! Freya! That really do be giving me, like... <laughs> that really does remind me of ReZero, that bit where, like, a uh, Subaru jumps off the cliff. And he's like, I'm gonna save you. I'm gonna save you all. And everyone's like, what the fuck? <laughs> anyway, so, looks like all we have left is Claire's ending. So, I'm, I'm assuming what uh, one of you guys in chat said is correct, and that I just have to open my eyes, Link. Okay, let me find... Let's see. Let me find the bit in the guide. Okay. Let me see. <laughs> Where's the thing for clear? Trying to find it. Owen, Owen, Owen. Clear. Okay, there we go. There we go. Got it pulled up. Okay. There's a red book pedestal and return to the dungeon. Okay, so we're gonna have to kill Mia again. Alright. Fun. Oh! Well, she's already dead. <laughs> This can't be happening. Yeah. Should I look? Yes. It's all blotchy. Get her a thing. Got the light blue scarf. Let us save. Yeah, that saves some trouble. Alright. Well then, let's get our best girl. <sighs> yep, someone there. Why is someone calling me? Hold on, give me a second. Okay, so apparently I'm gonna be getting a phone call in 45 minutes. So I'm just gonna pray that I can get through this game before they call me. Uh, because I know we got like... We're really close to beating the game, and I'm sorry about that, you guys. Um, but yeah, I, I got off the phone call. I have to do a test thing for tomorrow. Yeah, it's speedrun time. Uh. Yeah, I might end abruptly if they call me before I finish this, and if so, I'm sorry. I'll start up the stream after I'm done with all that again, if they do call me before I finish this. Yeah, I know you're you're clear. I heard a scream. Probably better to die. No. Mia didn't die. I'm going to find my friends. Okay. Let's go. Don't worry about it so much. We don't mind. Yeah. I just know it just come up, it just came up really suddenly. Um oh, they just texted me. Okay. Oh, incorrect link. Um, 
charging my phone because my phone is really low. I don't want to miss if they call me. Alright. Holes, climb through the hole. Maybe we can open it. No good. Okay. It's like something out of a murder mystery. Yep. Oh, the knife is gone. Let's go over here, pick up the knife. Get it. Get that knife. Try not to throw up. Oh, um, goodness. I don't have any medicine. No, it's just... Let's just get out of this room. That's a good idea. Okay. Kind of diorama. And we get the... Necklace. Alright, let's head on out. Put, let's start putting some stuff down here. And that's the girl, that's the boy. Gotta get the flowers. I use my phone all the time, but it's pretty much just to play games on my phone. Can I not enter this room? Okay. You baby. You baby! on the spines, not much of a library. How did I get down to his area again? How did I get down to Owen's area? Oh wait, it was in the chapel area, wasn't it? Over to the left. I would not make a good speedrunner. We gotta take the body. Wonder if we have to do that puzzle, what would we, or I guess we could use them as, if they're alive, huh? So yeah, that, that's fine. Yep. Alrighty. Alright, I get lost in my own town that I've lived in my whole life. My sense of direction is just as bad as my ability to read a map. That is a mood. Honestly, wait, did I not get the thing from the thing? Did I grab it? Yeah, I did. Well, I had to have if she's like right here with me, but yeah. Sorry, I'm just having a bit of a bad brain moment right now after that phone call. Still need two more. Yeah. 
just want it to be over. Can't save anyone. Lucas is probably... Do you think there was a way we could have warned Owen? You haven't given up, have you? I... It's okay. I can tell. Your spirit won't accept this fate so easily. Just trust me. Open them. Okay. Thank you. I... Clear! <laughs> Hopeless end. Oh, they're calling me. Um, I gotta end the stream all of a sudden. Bye! Sorry. So, now that we are officially at 1pm, uh, let's get started with Retrace. We might not talk for a bit because I'll be making a Butler Rickle edit. Ooh, I look forward to seeing that. YouTube is the evil stepmother's house. <laughs> you're right. You're right, Mason. Absolutely 100%. Let me pull up Retrace QR. There we go. Yeah, Butler Rachel. Oh, I'm sure Okami will be happy. Since Okami was asking for that. Did I pull up the game twice? I think I did. Well, we'll see. Okay. I don't think I pulled it up twice. That's good. I always seem to pull up this game twice whenever I... Well, I've only streamed it once, but yeah. <laughs> Hopefully Retrace shouldn't take too long. Also, I didn't upload the first episode of this to YouTube. So I'm gonna splice these together. So yeah, might take a while for the Retrace video to go up on YouTube. But yeah. Hopefully this should be the last one and we're going for Claire's End. So let me show you what I did. Okay. So I'm not sure if I tried this before because it's been a while since I tried playing, uh, since I tried playing Retrace, but I think my problem was that I was spawning through Mia's book and not through the bus stop. Oh no, Elio is a splicer. <laughs> So yeah, so you go here, and then you grab Mia's hand to get onto Mia's route. And then I'll show you what happens. God, there's like a truck outside. It's like really loud, but apparently my mic's not picking it up, so that's good. So yeah, typically when you examine this star, um, you just be like, oh, I'm gonna leave a note saying that Freya is here. But here's a new thing. Oh! I can use this, but what do I tell them? Um, let's see. Please be careful, the second tomb is trapped. Wait for a minute before turning the key. And there we go. All right. That was easy. All right. So I think that's the big thing that I missed for Claire's route. It's just that star right there. Okay. Get going, dude. Ooh, that's interesting. Yeah. Okay. I'm not sure what all endings I am missing. I think I'm just missing this and the Mioan end, but I'm still not completely sure how to get through the Mioan end. But yeah. Actually, I think what I'm doing right now might actually be the Mio and end and not the Claire end. Anyway, I gotta wait for this guy to walk by. Come on. Hey guys, since I'm making the Butler Reco edit, I had to ask, do I keep Reco's makeup? Do I take it off or do I change it completely? Um, I'd probably keep the makeup on. All right.
Okay. Oh, right. <laughs> I forgot to grab the key. Oh. Go away. Go away, bro. You gone? Why is he just standing there? Why is he just standing there? Uh I need a reload. Yeah, he's not moving. Oh my god! <laughs> okay. He never did that before. Please don't tell me the neck snapper glitched. Maybe he just gained a sentient AI that actually learned how to work. Okay, guy. Come on. That was fucking scary. Yeah. It was. He's the next Monica. <laughs> Yeah, that, that was scary. I'm so used to just him going through his, uh... Through his routine of just walking back and forth. So him staying like that was... Probably, like, not intentional. But it was really scary. Alright. So I think we're doing the Mioen route, actually. Record my thoughts. All right. The the store. This is they escaped. What? Who? Slow down, girl. Sorry, it's just they're okay. Owen and Lucas are okay. They are. <laughs> I'm so relieved I could cry, but I have to focus. The sooner I solve this puzzle, the sooner we can find them. Yay! Thank God. My children are okay. For now. <laughs> so let me see. Did they leave a note for me? No, they did not. Okay. I'm just glad that they're safe now. Alright. I'm happy. The children are good and happy. <laughs> Alright. Now we just gotta find them. Yeah, we gotta take him for the puzzle. Also, did I just sequence break? Because you're supposed to go through through here. <laughs> Okay, it doesn't look like I have the right key for this. Freeze! Don't come any closer! There they are! More potential suspects. Does it never cease? You guys! <laughs> What's the hair? D don't disturb the crime scene! It's fine. I have already arrived at an answer. I have browsed too many Reddit threads to come up with this answer. As expected from Mr. Holmes. You're too kind, my dear Watson. Yeah. <laughs> oh, thank God those two dumbasses didn't get killed by something else, right? I'm so glad. I, I had a feeling they were probably just gonna find another way to get killed, so I'm happy. I'm very happy right now. Can you believe this? Here I was, thinking you two were dead, and you're off playing detective. Right? God. It's imperative that we complete these puzzles in order to progress. Exactly. Yo, that's pretty gay, bro. Oh. Twitch, what the fuck are you doing? Yo, that's pretty gay, bro. There we go. Sorry that Twitch bans the use of gay that's 
they don't understand who it is the person streaming, apparently. Or what type of game we're playing, apparently. I'm just glad you're both safe. <laughs> you didn't need to worry. The two of us are unstoppable. Isn't that right, Lucas? Indeed. They don't understand the memes. <laughs> okay, that's great, but can you please tell us who the murderer is? Uh, it was the sister. <laughs> well, bye. Uh, this game is very, very gay. Lucas gets shot. No, unstoppable my ass. <laughs> what? What just happened? The door appears to have opened. Shall we proceed? I might have spoke too soon. <laughs> Not the moment, dude. Oh, sorry. Well, I will go on to the next room. Please, uh, follow when you are ready. Thanks. Those poor people. That was horrible. We've got to be close to escaping, right? Indeed we are. Indeed we are. Okay, is the knife here? I don't think the knife is here. Do I really need to look at this again? I guess not. Hello. Hi. Hmm. Just say it. Say what? I can tell you want to ask me something. You can. Very well. That note. Currently only you and I know about it. I didn't show it to Owen. Why not? I didn't want him to rush to a conclusion. And what conclusion might that be? I have a few theories. Nothing concrete. I know two things. You have information that you should not have. Ah, oh, he's on to us! That we are time travelers. Well, we're going to the library, so Owen and Mia are not allowed to touch anything, and Lucas is not allowed either, just to be safe. <laughs> and that you use that information to assist us. Yeah, do not touch the, the, the diorama green and blue sheep thing, people. I wanted to hear it from you. How did you know what to write on that note? Touch. <laughs> You're not going to... Actually, you might be the one person who would believe me. I've been here before. Not... not here. Here, this part's new. Last time, Owen died at the tomb puzzle, and you disappeared. Lucas, sweetie, please just accept it as a plot convenience. <laughs> He's too smart. We can't hide it. But if I take your hand at the start, not Mia's, we solve the tombstone puzzle together. But then Owen and Maya die. Time travel. Not exactly. I think I really am dying. I just get to come back somehow. Have you ever watched the anime ReZero, Lucas? You look like you might be an anime watcher. Hmm, that would fit the facts, yes. The other explanation is that you're in cahoots with the culprit, but that seems unlike you. Gee, thanks. Um, you must have gone through a lot. It's a re-zero. <laughs> it's a pretty good anime. I highly recommend it. You don't have to try and comfort me. Thanks, though. It's pretty similar to the plot of this, like, Protag, whenever he dies, he goes back in time and he tries to stop shit that happens. Hmm. Hmm. I grabbed the librarian's keys. Need these. Okay, you guys, don't touch anything while I'm up here. Gonna need this. Let's see here. Freya. Lucas looks like he's cosplaying someone from Naruto. Changed my mind. <laughs> he does kind of look like, uh, what's his name? Neji? Neji Hyuga? Hinata's brother? 
Look, let's just keep going. This is the furthest I've gotten with everyone alive. We might be on the right path this time. Let's solve it. There's a plaque. Farmer must transport... Yeah, yeah, yeah. We gotta transport... Not like I have much of a choice. Yeah, we gotta do it now. I need the wolf, the sheep, and the cabbage to be on the same side. Okay, so what was it? I think it was that you move the sheep, and then you go back, and then you get, like, I think, I think. But I I've actually never failed this before. Like, will it kill me if I fail this? Hold on. So I think it's sheep. Yeah, it's sheep. I'm on the right side with the sheep. And then we go back alone. And then we get the cabbage. And then we take the sheep back. And then we take the wolf. And then we go back alone. And there we go. All right. Lucas has always given me vampire vibes, so even though I'm uncertain it isn't true, I am convinced he is, in fact, a gay vampire. <laughs> Sorry about that, everyone. Oh, you're done already? Yeah. Whoa, you okay? Lucas, what did you say to her? Nothing. It's nothing. Freya? This place takes its toll on the mind. It's admirable to press onwards, but there's no shame in resting. Right, yeah. All right. Yeah, we, he's just not gonna talk to me. <laughs> We've gotta be close to escaping, right? Yep. Signs point to yes. Are you truly all right to carry on? Do I have a choice? You could rest, and then you would kill me. You keep saying that, but I can't. Not yet. You're secretly a very stubborn person, aren't you? I like that about you. Not like you too, baby! You may have killed me, but you're still my favorite. Wanna hug it out? Of course! I... Hmm? Um, nothing. Tell you later. Ah, uh, 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 a part of me wants to say okay, but then what if there, what if there is no later, chat? What if there is no later? We will not rest around Claire without keeping watch. <laughs> okay, you better tell me though. This better be the flag to make sure that you live, Mia. <laughs> All right, so now we've got a guaranteed love confession. Right, that, that better be a love confession, right Mia? Took the wolf key. Okay, let's go back to the lo lobby then, fellas. She might catch on if you say there is no later, say okay, he. No good, doesn't look like I got the right key for this. Wait, how did I get in then? <laughs> It, it unlocked. There we go. Okay, if we all work together, I know we can get out of here. That big door is definitely suspicious, right? It has three locks of different shapes and sizes. Working together, huh? I really like this music, by the way. It's a nice remix of the uh, title theme music. Alright guys, here's the plan. If I were hiding keys, I'd definitely put one in that chest in the chapel. Want me to go take another look? I might be able to figure something out. Thanks. Okay, I'll be right back. You better not get killed, Mia! Owen, there's a big rock in the dungeon. Think you can move it for me. Who the hell do you think you're talking to? Hold up, you'll need this key. <laughs> Thanks. Alright, here I go. And not get caught by the sentient AI now. 
And me? Well, you usually just give me the third key when we're in here, and it's always covered in gore. And then I believe I might have an idea. Ah, yes, our man. Our man that goes digging through corpses. I take the gore-covered key. Hooray. If that's all, I'll go help Maya. Right. You're not gonna go... Uh, well, of course he's not gonna go help his boyfriend, because that would require physical labor. Whew. Um, did you and Lucas have a fight? You seemed a little awkward before. If anyone dies, I will riot. Same. I'm, I'm a bit feared because we still have this end and the Claire end to do, so I'm like... Uh, um, nothing, really. I see. Forgive me for probing. Uh, how are you holding up? Oh, I'm quite well, thank you. I suppose I'm a little nervous. What's behind that door, I wonder? But the game's logic, Mia is dying. Just send a rule 36 artist after the AI and they will be safe. Oh, and your boyfriend is digging through corpses again. <laughs> Hopefully the real world. Real world? I mean, outside, you know, where we were before. Actually, I think this place probably is another world. It's just a feeling I have, but... Yeah, I think that thing with the eyeballs, the sentinel, I, I think that would definitely be a tall tale sign that we're in another world. Don't tell Lucas, he's still holding out for aliens. <laughs> It'll be our secret then. Yay, you guys are safe, thank God. I hope Owen's safe. Found it! Mia handed me the ornate key. Thank God. Ugh. Owen threw the rusty key at me. There. Uh, are you okay? I nearly got eaten by some creepy thing. There's no way it should have been able to see me. They do have a great number of eyes. They probably sense that you are on the verge of opening the door. Which we should totally get back to. Oh, hey, you guys found a key too. Why is there blood on it? Yes, everyone is alive so far, thank God. <laughs> Unimportant. Fea, will you do the honors? I guess so. Yeah, no way I'd get that lucky, but... Hey, Mia. Way ahead of you. Lucas, get over there and stand very still. Freya, give me a leg up. We even got isekai We really are in ReZero. <laughs> I did it? Yeah! Whoa! Go team! Congratulations, Freya. Save it for when we're out. This isn't the way out. This is... Food! Oh my god, I'm starving! Hold up, guys. Let's not eat the mystery food right away. But it looks so good. This has got to be some kind of reward, right? You did it, here's your prize? Someone mentioned ReZero, heck yeah. <laughs> I wonder. It's a welcome barn. Stop, it's poisoned, I just know it. Yeah, it's probably gonna be poisoned. We still have this end and Claire's end to do after all. I'm going for it. God damn it, it's poisoned, isn't it? So good, I could cry. Leave some for the rest of us, okay? Oh, no, don't. You better hurry up then. I knew I, w I will summon Barn by mentioning ReZero. <laughs> Mia now reminds me of Aoi, Asahina, gay and always hunger. <laughs> Less than thought. I'm just enjoying the atmosphere. The scent of flowers. I've greatly missed it. What about the food? Uh, I'm not all that hungry. Come to think of it, we didn't come across any food before. She must have been eating something, right? But what's there to- Maybe she's a ghost! Oh. Oh god. Are you okay, Freya? You look a little pale. 
It's, um, nothing. I'm just not going to think about it. Did she, did she eat people's corpses? God, I wish she'd eat my corpse. Not gonna have anything? Mm, not right now. Barn was isekai here into Elias' chat. <laughs> I'll make sure the greedy guts leaves you something. <laughs> I knew he was an isekai protagonist. <laughs> I am a barn and I got transported into another world? <laughs> I'm good, thanks. This tea party is a reference to the witch's tea party found in episode 3 of season 2 of the popular isekai series ReZero Kara Hajimere Isekai Seikatsu. <laughs> so, here we are. Pass the door. Congratulations. What art style does this remind you of, Joe? If you were trying to sound sincere, you failed. Sorry, something's just bothering me about this room. The fact that we're probably getting poisoned as we speak. Yeah, a congratulatory feast is nice, but where's the exit? Exactly. All of that and we just hit another dead end. It seems there's no way to leave under our own power. We remain at the mercy of our captor. Our own power? Am I supposed to use my power to escape? If that's the case, then the answer must be in the void somewhere. There's colored jewels. I have to go back. I'll say hello, Jackie. Welcome, welcome. This is a dead end. I must have missed something. I'll have to rewind. That chasm should do it. Freya, where are you going? Oh, not retrace. I mean pocket mirror. Sorry, brain blacked out. Okay, it's a weird Mario horror game though. I use music box. Correction: Owen is getting poisoned. Yeah, he's eating everything for all of us. So he's gonna get poisoned, and we're gonna starve to death. Once more into the void, I guess. Sorry, everyone. I'll save you next time. Freya. Unprepared end. Freya, it's rewind time. <laughs> Alright, so that was not the Mioan end. So I'm not sure what I was supposed to do there. Let me look for the clear end. Where's the clear end? There we go. It's a red book, pedestal, and return to the dungeon. Hold on. Owen dies, we star, Freya jumps. Okay, let's go to the dungeon. Well, shoot, gotta die again. <laughs> no, it's gone. No point sending another. It didn't have any crackers, so Freya jumped out of despair. <laughs> okay. Thoughts. You think that's for the cell? Yep. Pick up the set of keys. Okay, bro, walk past me again. Alright. Do 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 do. Come on, bro, walk past me. It takes forever. <laughs> There we go. Oh wait, I'm supposed to let the sentinel catch me. Hold on. Sorry, Mia, this is for Claire's end. Bye. <laughs> okay. Sorry, I just wanna get best girl's end. I hope you understand. Well, rip.
Sorry, Mia, you must die so best girl can live. <laughs> Mia didn't die for me to give up and wait on death. I'm going to go find my friends, and we're going to find a way out of here. Coming? Okay. F in the chat for Mia for about the fifth time. <laughs> All right. Oh. Okay. Wait, let me let me save Aroni. We're out of the dungeon. Okay. I don't like how the music sounds in here. Take the golden necklace. And I will save. Quit my thoughts. Shoot, Mia dies again. Just another Monday. <laughs> All right, so then I'm gonna go over here. Don't need to go back in there, thank God. Maybe I shouldn't say that in the chapel. Empty and locked, okay. The guide said something about the chapel, so I just wanted to make sure I wasn't missing it. Elio, choose me as root. Demon looking at Mia. It's free real estate. <laughs> yeah, I am brave, baby. Wanna marry me? And this for sorrow. Is it six for gold? What a dirty adult you are! <laughs> God. Okay, so are they still dead? What a dirty adult you are! <laughs> Two at once. Well, Mia is dead, but Owen is alive at least. So that's good. All right, uh, that's relatively good, I mean. <laughs> All right, this is, they got my message. Seem pleased, did something good happen? Yes, Owen and Lucas are okay. That's wonderful news. <laughs> I'm so relieved I could cry, but I have to focus. The sooner I solve this puzzle, the sooner I can find them. All right, so let's head on back. Go back to the chapel. Oh, I didn't take the the knife, did I? Yeah, I go take the knife. Hmm. This poses something of a problem, doesn't it? Yeah, we've been to all the rooms we can, but we haven't seen those two. Which means we don't have a boy. Unless they went through that huge door, but it was locked. Did we miss something? Let's see. Could they have gotten through that gap up there? It might be possible. No, that has to be it. We've looked everywhere else after all. What a dirty adult you are. God. <laughs> ReZero game, ReZero game, it's real. Oh yeah, there is a ReZero game, isn't there? They're making games of all the isekais, aren't they? I know Konosuba is also getting a game. It's still locked, though. Seriously, those two. Don't worry, I'm sure they'll come back to us. <laughs> no, you're right. So, I guess we just gotta wait until then. Yeah, I suppose so. Don't worry, as long as we're together, everything will be fine. Yes, I couldn't have said it any better, Claire. I love you. You think? I'm certain of it. Hey, Freya? Hmm? Thank you. Yes, we got a CG of the best baby! For what? 
And the collector's edition gives you a pin of a blue-haired maid I can't seem to remember being in the series. <laughs> God, don't hurt me like this, Barn. For this little happiness. I'm glad I was able to spend this peaceful time with you. It's not gotcha, it's a legit visual novel. Nice! But this isn't satisfying, is it? I can feel it. You can't accept this, can you? What are you saying? Shh, close your eyes. I'll be waiting for you in the next world. Yay, we got the clear end, finally. At last. Also, did the middle book light up? It's blank, okay, no. It did not light up, okay. So let's see. So I think, I think all we have left now is the Mioan end. Okay. Met my friends, yes. Okay, back outside. If I can't pay for JPEGs of Felix, then what's the point? <laughs> I mean, you'll probably get a Felix root in it. Okay. Yep, what do I tell them? Please be careful, second tomb is trapped. Yep, 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 yep. Okay. All right, let's see. Continue through the dungeon as if on Mia's route. Felix is one of my favorite characters, so completely understandable, you guys. Yeah, to see Felix's sprites, let's do it. Then you can make little edits of Felix's sprite. I'm sorry, Goldie, but I love Amelia. I also love Amelia, but... But consider for a moment. Felix. Just consider for a moment. Amelia is probably my third favorite after the maids. Because of course I have to stand the maids. But like, the, the start of ReZero is just so good. And how Amelia is, like, immediately loved her. Like, I, I completely understand why Subaru is so obsessed with saving her. Oh, I forgot to grab the key, as always. That's like the one thing I never remember to do. Third favorite? There's only one maid. <laughs> Shut up, Vaughn, I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> Well, technically, you're there too now with Beast Girl Frederica. <laughs> Barn! Elia's stand is made. Its power is that it's able to clean up anything. God, I wish that I had that power in real life. Then I could clean my room. <laughs> Alright, let's get you out of here, baby. Was I supposed to get her out? You know what? Hold on. Let me see if I can progress without getting Claire out. No, okay. Okay, we have to get Claire out. I mean, I wouldn't have wanted to love leave without Claire, but I am kind of a completionist, so you know. It was like watching uh so watching Manly Badass Heroes uh Tigachi video earlier. <laughs> and I know that feeling all too well of doing fucked up things for the sake of completionism. <laughs> Alright. So let's see. Let's go to the chapel. All the character needs is uh to be a maid to be Elio's favorite character. You're right. You're right, Goldie. I also have a maid radar. I can tell when a character is a maid even when I don't know that they're a maid. 
like, for example, I knew that, like, I stand Kotori before I found out she was a maid. I had that maid radar. So, yeah. <laughs> yes, I did see Best Girl Kitty Giddy in a maid outfit. It sent me to heaven. <laughs> okay. All right, let's use the south middle door. Okay, so now we're in the parlor and here they are. Here they are, the good boys. I guess we're just not gonna talk to them though. Hello. Hi. Just say it. Say what? I can tell you want to ask me something. You can, and very well. That note, yeah. Why not? Don't want him to rush to a conclusion. Not use the information. Not going to actually, yeah. Okay, we already saw this. Uh, I have a gremlin radar. I always know when a character's gonna be a little piece of shit, even before they give any signs. <laughs> Elio's secret ability is the maid R, capable of finding maids anywhere around him within a 20 kilometer radius. <laughs> All right, so there we are. Let's go up the ladder and retrieve the necklace. Okay, gonna need this. Take the keys on the desk. Thank God it is there. And then we solve the diorama puzzle. This is the furthest I've gotten with everyone around. Yeah, let's solve it. Okay. So, we take the sheep. Take the sheep. And then we go back. And we take, what was it? Was it the cabbage? I think it was the cabbage, right? We take the cabbage. Now I got a sheep, cabbage, and shepherd. I always forget how to do this, but then I get it at the end. Uh, let's take the sheep back. Move the wolf. Or was it the sheep? Yeah, we won't move the wolf. Take the shepherd back alone. Yep, there we go. anyone has a crush on me goldie <laughs> but if they do yes if they wear a maid outfit it will make their chances better <laughs> i actually had a friend that wore a maid outfit just because they knew it would get me flustered <laughs> are you okay lucas what did you say to her you can just imagine Elia walking around and suddenly their eyes go wide as they hear a loud beeping in their head. The maid radar has activated and they will find the maid that activated it. <laughs> God, you guys know me too well. Freya? This place takes its toll on the mind. Me. Okay, let me... Okay, so now what do we do? We grab the key. Let's go back to the lobby. Need outfit gets a eight plus multiplier to charisma when in Elliot's presence. Our maid outfit fluster Elliot today. Give me some some Photoshop. <laughs> I know we can get out of here. Big door is definitely suspicious. Yep. All right, guys, hiding keys. Definitely put one in the chest in the chapel. Yep. Um, do the same thing that we did before. Give me a picture, any picture, I will edit it into a maid outfit and send it to Elio. <laughs> okay, I think, I think the thing was that we didn't do Claire's end. So I, we might get a different dialogue this time. If you really wanna know. If, if you don't mind telling me, I promise I won't breathe a word of it. 
Yeah, the thing is, this isn't the first time I've done this. I keep, I don't know, repeating, retracing my steps, trying to get out. We're so close this time. Searching through the threads of fate for a single path that will bring you to salvation. Like something from a fairy tale. Do you think so? Gonna need to start keeping a maid folder. <laughs> I have a maid folder. Oh yes, you make a wonderful hero. If you buy the maid outfit for 50 mono coins, you can unlock an extra cutscene with Elio's maid cult. <laughs> Title drop. I might actually buy that ReZero VN. Hell yeah, I probably will too. I don't feel very heroic. Mostly I feel like the idiot who keeps getting her friends killed. But they do not remember it, yes? So really, it's as though it never happened. Your friends are happy and healthy here. Freya, perhaps it's not my place to say this, but to me, you really are a wonderful hero, so please, do not lose heart now. There's also a Konosuba game, and I think there's a Danmachi game coming out soon. So I'm excited to see those as well. I... thanks, Claire. It is no trouble at all. Okay, fine. I will just to annoy everyone with Felix fan art. <laughs> it won't annoy me. It will make me happy. I've never even watched ReZero. Yes, you should watch it. Yes, Hagu. The answer is yes. <laughs> it's very good. <laughs> Me and Barn just cornering Hagu, shaking Hagu, telling Hagu to watch ReZero. <laughs> There's a very slow start, so it's understandable if you don't get into it at the start, but I personally, when I saw the first episode, it just immediately got me, like, hooked. But I can understand why the start might be annoying. For some. Guess I need to figure out where this key goes. Oh? I don't think she said that before. So, here we are. Pass the door. Congratulations. If you were trying to sound sincere, you failed. Sorry, something's been bothering me about this room. Yeah. A congratulatory feast is nice, but where is the exit? Exactly. It's hard to look him in the eye. Harder than usual, anyway. But it's okay. He's okay. I did the right thing. Okay. I found short-haired Amelia just now, and words can't describe the amount of pure serotonin flowing through my veins. <laughs> Gonna have anything? Mm, not right now. Make sure this greedy guts gets you something. Lesson thought. I'm just enjoying the atmosphere, the scent of flowers. I've greatly missed it. What about the food? Uh, I'm not all that hungry. In your hand? Oh, this? Oh, is it yours? How did you know? It matches your dress. <laughs> You're so clever, Freya. I love that about you. I'm so very glad that you found it. I knew you would. So, if this brooch is yours, does that make you the lock? Hm? Huh? She called it a key, so you must be the lock. That's not a very nice thing to say. Sorry, but I don't get it. I kind of thought the reward for solving that puzzle would be, you know, a way out. Oh goodness, you're still talking about that? What? Your reward isn't to leave, it's to stay. I'm not following. I, I am following. I would want to stay with Claire. Now that you've overcome all the challenges of this world, you can stay here forever. It may be a tiny world, but it has everything you could ever want or need. And if I don't want to? Why wouldn't you? I mean, I have my family, friends. 
my whole life to get back to. You don't want to stay with me? Oh, I do, baby, I do. You can come too, you know. I can't. I can never leave this place. And neither can you. Claire? You were supposed to understand by now. Claire isn't talking to Freya here. She's talking directly to Elio. I am listening, Claire. I will stay here with you, Claire. I just want to beat the game. I'm sorry, Claire. Freya? Claire? What's going on? Weren't you having fun? Fun? I had to watch my friends die. Oh no, she's going on, Dede. But they're fine now. Besides, didn't that make it more satisfying when you were able to save them? A game isn't fun if the stakes aren't high. And now you don't even want the reward I prepared for you? Seriously, what the fuck are you two going on about? Shut up! I'll show you. I'll make you understand. Owen. Don't come any closer! Claire, stop it! Leave them alone! I won't hurt them. I just want everyone to understand. Understand how wonderful a world this is. Yeah, I'm dead. <laughs> Claire, please, sweetie. Ugh. Don't want to get up. Ugh. It's tempting, but I can't. Hmm? Weird. The sheets smell kind of like perfume. Oh, are we in a Claire world now? Did Claire make a world for us? My faithful slippers. Pity I can't wear them out. Well, I guess there's nothing stopping me, but I still feel a bit weird about it. Are we looping? I think we're looping. But what if instead of going out, I played video games instead? That's what I ask myself every day, and I always choose to play video games. Must resist. Claire, please, if you're going to go yandere on anyone, please choose me. <laughs> Bar, no, choose me, Claire. <laughs> when the ravens cry, cadaver festival, demons of life. Oh, I think these are different games from last time. So we got Higarashi or Umineko, Cadaver Festival, and Demons of Life. I don't know what the other ones are references to. I think last time had a Yume Nikki reference. So yeah. Elio, I will fight you. I'll fight you too, Barn! Let's go! I've probably forgotten all the solutions by now, too. Building my first Sentinel. Claire and I having a tea party. The time some of my Tenma's de demon friends came to visit? Yep! This is a world clear made. This is the big hint right here. Fight me, y'all. If anyone's getting stabbed by Claire, it's me. I will fight you, Jackie. Good memories. We'll kill each other before Claire can even kill us. Ow. Why is my head throbbing all of a sudden? Okay, you know what? Go fight over the Yandere. I will take Owen and run. <laughs> Jackie, you have Lynn to stab you. Exactly, please. Give me a crumb of Yondere, Jackie. <laughs> Why? What's going on? Everything's supposed to be perfect here, so... Why do I feel like something's wrong? My skull feels like it's going to crack open. Okay. What choice are we gonna choose? Uh... This is wrong. I don't belong here. I have to save my friends. That's right, everyone. I have to make sure they get out of here safely. Elio, you have like half the chat to stab you. <laughs> but are you Claire though? Claire messed with my memories. She must be getting desperate. But that's not important right now. I have to go find my friends. All right, anything new here? No. Okay. I like how she still says that. <laughs> oh, a secret passage. Why'd it open like that? I get the knife wife. <laughs> you have your YouTube audience, Barn! You can have your YouTube audience stab you! 
Someone's on the other side. Can't stay in here forever, though. Oh, Claire. You wearing a new dress? Oh. Who are you? Uh, I'm Freya. Who are you? <laughs> oh, I'm, um, Lily. I do kind of look like Claire. If I cosplay and stab you, can the real one stab Barn? Asking for a friend. I want to be stabbed by the real one, but I won't mind getting stabbed either way. <laughs> nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Um, are you Claire's friend? Uh, sort of, I guess, maybe? It's complicated. She did kidnap me and mess with my memories. She did? Oh, why would she do that? My audience won't stab me? God damn it! This is an excellent question. Holy shit, she's so pretty. Get out of the way. I call dibs. <laughs> this chat is just fighting each other to see who can get to date these characters. Claire, she can act a little strange sometimes, but she has a good heart. I'm sure if I ask her to let you go, she will. So, you and she are... I'm her sister. No wonder you look like her. No wonder I mistook you for her. Oh, uh, in that case, I have some questions. Just what in general? <laughs> that, that would be me. Where are we? We stab each other in order to win the right to be stabbed by fictional girls. <laughs> We're, um, hmm. I don't know what you'd call it. It's a special world that Claire can control. Also, Joe, I have cosplayed Natsuki, so if you want, I can just stab you. <laughs> it's supposed to be a place where we can play together and be safe for all eternity. Right, safe, huh? I'm here. Can we leave this room? Of course. You guys are fighting for Claire, and I'm just here simping for Lucas and Owen. <laughs> I also stand Lucas. Okay, whew. I can give you a guided tour if you'd like. I'm here. What is she? I'm not sure what you mean. I mean, I've already met a demon today. She's not a demon, I think. As a member of Barnes' audience, I assure you, we will not stab him. See, I knew Goldie wouldn't stab me. God damn. <laughs> I'm pretty sure we're both human. I'm not really sure how to tell. Just what in general? This was the question I was waiting to choose. You're gonna have to be more specific than that. Sorry, it's been a long day. You do look tired. Yeah, I've died like at least tw 20 times by now, I'm guessing. If you tell me to rest, I may punch you. Got it. While I'm here, let's get out of here. I have to go find my friends again. I'm sure if we just talk to Claire, we can sort this whole thing out. Sure. Does this take me back to my room? Okay. Filled with beautiful dresses and shoes and jewelry. Claire's so generous, isn't she? Sure. It's an awful lot of books about vampires. Now, now, some of them are about werewolves. Oh, and this one is about a girl who finds out she's secretly a wood nymph. She grows this beautiful pair of petal we wings right before the big dance, and... <laughs> Sorry, I got carried away, didn't I? It's fine. That's honestly relatable. This is me in high school. That's the type of books I read when I still read books. I have to go find my friends again. I'm sure, yeah. A young blonde girl stands between a man and a woman. Everyone's faces are slightly out of focus. Are these your parents? 
Yes, we were very close. What about Claire? Oh, well, I live with her, so I don't need pictures of her. Is that you subtly saying that you don't really like Claire? Okay. There's, yep. It's empty. I used to have a little parakeet, but I felt bad, so I let him go. I see. Is it really okay to let a parakeet fly freely in a place like this? And steal everyone's waifus through osmosis. Also, why is waifu a banned term? Come on. Curse you, Automod. <laughs> Automod said no waifu rights. Oh gosh, who left this line here? With Tenma, probably, but I can't exactly tell her that. I wonder if it still works. Ugh, can't get back to the void. I think I can still save my progress. Better be careful. What should I do? Record my thoughts. Grab his knife, ready to stab Barn if he tries to take Natsuki. <laughs> All done. I'm too weak to stab someone. Shooting makes you feel powerful no matter how much strength the other person has as long as you aren't within reach. They can't defend themselves from a gun. Damn, Hagu. Okay. Let's see, so... Oh, Alright, this just goes back to your room? Gotcha. Aren't you going to follow me? Uh, it's just that these paths are quite narrow, and with this dress- Wait, what, what Natsuki are you talking about, Joe? <laughs> I, I thought you were talking about Doki Doki Literature Club Natsuki. But I don't think she's 20. <laughs> um, you show me where you want to go and I'll follow after you. Alright. I know there's a bunch of Natsukis, like there's Natsuki from Utapri. Yeah, I'm guessing it's a different Natsuki, Goldie. I also thought that he was talking about, uh, <laughs> Doki Doki Natsuki at first. She's not in here. Alright. Natsuki is 18, but the game is almost three years old. That only counts if the canon progresses in the years. Like if Kai, like Kai and Dot Hack, like he's 14 and Dot Hack infection, but he gets older and Dot Hack to you. That's the only time when I count ages going up. This room is somewhat unsettling. That's putting it lightly. Hagu, that's why knives are fun. You get a 50-50 chance to win or lose. Both the hope and despair in the situation of a knife fight is fun. Misa no you, Junko Anoshima. Complicated diagrams and barely legible notes. It works like that for Atelier Riza. I, yeah, I haven't played Atelier Riza, but doesn't that take place, what, one or two years after the first game? This looks like some kind of map. Oh wait, well, all Atelier games take place over the course of a couple of years, so yeah. This looks like some kind of map. Chapel, parlor, mausoleum. Those are all the areas we were in in the game. There's a scissors. Where's Lizette? She's not- that's not a very comfortable looking bed. I don't think it's a bed, Lily. Then, what's it for? For human experiments, of course. I don't know, but nothing good, I suspect. Uh, I see. Okay, nothing there. That- yeah, that's not- that's not a bed, Lily. That is not a bed. I mean, the creator said a part two was coming out back in 2018, but that never happened, so... 
I don't think it's right until another game comes out, Joe. <laughs> These are pictures of Lucas. This man. You know him? I'm not sure. These are all pictures of me, Owen, and Maya. There are notes, too. Our personalities, likes, dislikes. Does Monica even have a birthday? Oh, August 22nd. Remember that. Oh, yeah, that's coming up soon. Ten days from now. Gotta celebrate Best Girl's birthday. What was that? I don't know, but... Quick, hide. Where? Under the bed. Find a corpse. Hide in the corpse. Well, I think that about covers everything. Any questions? No. Excellent. Well, I'll be upstairs. Let me know if you need anything. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> we celebrate B-Days, but they don't actually age. Yeah. Um... Should we emerge? Or should we wait until he leaves? I'm conflicted. Uh, I'll emerge. He's my buddy. Ah. Uh, Freya, you're alive. For now, yeah. I'm... I'm glad. Yeah, alright. Come on. Gotta go find the others. What? I... I have to stay here. Excuse me? I'm staying here, Freya. This is the best place for me. You know your best place is with your boyfriend. Have you lost your mind? I don't expect you to understand. Please, I won't alert them to your presence. So just go. Come on, Lily. Okay. What the fuck, bro? I thought we were bros. Thought we were bros, my dude. I guess that's not unlocked. Okay. Let me go save. Record my thoughts. Let me guess. Claire's like making an ideal world for all of us to be happy. It's an empty door frame. Claire's always adding new rooms to play in. She must be working on that one. She can manipulate this world that easily, huh? This is another reason why Claire is best girl. She just wants you to be happy. Ah, the door's ajar. I hear talking. If I peer through like this... So, when are you going to send everyone back? Hmm? Why do you ask? Oh, it's nothing. I just... I just want a chance to say goodbye properly, you know? Of course. But are you sure that's what you want? What? I see how you look at her. I... that's not... She's precious to me. It's more important that she be happy, you know? And she can't be happy stuck here. Is that so? What's wrong? Watch Owen probs eat so much food till he died. <laughs> That's probably why we haven't seen him yet. He's just off eating somewhere. You're just so wonderfully selfless, Mia. It's very endearing. Uh, oh, thank you. I just wish everyone could be happy together. Aw, don't look so down. We'll be happy, just the two of us. I'll take care of you, okay? <laughs> oh, don't cry. Come here. There, there. Everything will be okay now. Oh, Freya. How long have you been standing there? I've now become a maid. You will see if you do art time at the end. Oh, boy. But I must be going, sadly. Have fun. Alright, see you later, Barn. <laughs> Thank God you're okay. Come on, we've got to go find Owen. Lucas is... Oh, Freya. I'm sorry I let you down before, but... It's okay. You don't have to worry about any of that anymore. I took care of everything for you. Oh no. Huh? What's wrong? Mia, what have you done? I talked to Claire. 
She's going to let you guys go home, safe and sound. That's great. See, Freya, I told you. Um, Freya? God damn it. What? You should be happy. You're gonna get to go home. You guys, as in, not you. Uh, yeah, that was the deal. But hey, three out of four ain't bad, right? This is a joke, right? Don't cry, it'll be a beautiful sacrifice. What happens to me doesn't matter, as long as the people I care about are happy and safe. Mia, you sacrifice yourself way too much. All of your deaths have been trying to protect other people. Please, please, care a bit more about your own well-being, Mia, please. I won't be happy. Why'd you keep doing this? Uh, that's my cue. I'd better get going. What? Get going where? To Claire, of course. I'm going to be her personal guard. Isn't that great? It's perfect for me. Wait. <sighs> um. Okay, I'm good. Let's go. You don't look good. I just... She's always been like this. Even for little things, like... Offering to drive, even if she's tired, or comforting me when she's sad, too. But that just means that this time, I have to be the one to save her. So, Claire probably tells everyone she'll let the others go if they stay, and then she's like, Well, you agreed to stay. So Mia has hero complex. Yep. Yeah. More to the point, Claire probably told Lucas something similar. We'd better go get the truth out of him. And we still haven't found Owen. It should be decorated with photos and trinkets. Seeing it bare like this is kind of creepy. All the photos she keeps on here are gone. Wow, this room is tiny. Alright. Let's go see if we can... Talk to Lucas. Also, did I check over here? No, I did not. Locked. Okay. Well, it's locked, so. Oh, you're over here now. Why are you over here now? You go on ahead and I'll follow you. I don't want to, um, get in your way. It's an empty door frame. Oh, okay. You're just standing there. Because you just felt like standing there. Okay. Good. He's still here. Lucas. Lucas. We have to talk. Please, snap out of it. At least, help me find Owen, okay? He's not here. What? I've looked everywhere. I even asked Claire. And she said he isn't here. She's probably lying. If she's lying, then where is he? Have you seen him? Huh? He's crying. No. Oh. What do you mean he's not here? I thought perhaps you... If there's something you're not telling me, what are you doing? If you really understood him, you'd know exactly where he is. That should be easy for you, right? That's what she said. An elegant trap, isn't it? If I could just understand him. But he I don't. He either escaped somehow or died. She stole Owen. Probably to keep him here. But because of that, he is lost to me forever. So instead, I will stay here. Owen at least six deaths. Mia at least six deaths. Freya at least eight. Oh, I know Freya's done at least, like... At least every time someone dies, Freya has to die, so she can go back in time. Do you think that's what he'd want? If it's not, he should come here and tell me that himself. I can understand other people, and other people can't understand me. If I stay here, I won't have to worry about either of those things. I truly, truly hope that you escape, Freya. Now, if you'll excuse me. The fastest way to snap him out of this is going to be to find Owen, huh? If I can find the tiniest hint... I have an idea! Even though I don't. 
You're wrong. I'm sorry. He's not lost forever. Actually, I think I know where he is. Don't do this, Freya. Even I. I just need some kind of clue. One little thing. Freya, is everything okay? Wait, just maybe... I think I know where we can find a clue. I'm listening. In my room, in Claire's room, in... In Claire's room, probably? I've already looked in there. Is he eating something or did he fall asleep in the coffin? <laughs> Lucas, cool voice that matches KG. Also, Lucas, excuse me, starts crying. <laughs> did you look everywhere? Under the bed? Behind the curtains? In the closet? She probably thought you wouldn't look for a young lady's things. You of all people should know I have no such com compunction. I searched the entire room. He wasn't there. Maybe he moved? For my sake, at least, be serious. C come on, Freya, think. Lucas is the most thorough person I know. If there was any clue to Owen's location, he would have found it. So I have to assume it was somewhere he couldn't find. Somewhere that wasn't available to him. At least until now. The one room without the frame, I would assume. Let me see. This open? Okay, it's not open yet. Might have to talk to Lucas one more time, but let me just make sure. Something tells me there isn't a third game. Well, that was just if this wound up being short. So no. No third game. So I'm glad I didn't say what it was gonna be. I can save that for another time. Got good, he's still here. Yeah. Get me to the choice, please. I have an idea. In this room. Now you mock me. I'm being serious. What was it? I'm not saying it. I'm not saying it until... Until I know that I'm gonna be doing it. Very well. What clue is it that I could have missed? I don't want to get you guys hyped up on anything. In case I don't wind up doing it for a while. Lucas is the most thorough person I know. If there was any clue to Owen's location, he would have found it. We're gonna learn what it was when Elio plays it. <laughs> yep. So I have to assume it was somewhere he couldn't find. Somewhere that wasn't available to him. At least, until now. This. I think it's this, right? Lily, I've got a question for you. Yes? That ring on your necklace, may I take a look at it? Huh? I suppose so. Is something wrong with it? Lily showed me the gold ring. Look familiar, Lucas? That's... where did you get that? Well, I'm taking a guess and saying one bit heart. No, that's not what I was planning. If I do do one bit heart, it will probably be on my birthday. Yeah. I... I don't know. I've always had it. Always? Just... How long is always? Uh, um... That is... You. What did you do to him? I... I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know anyone named Owen. Give me that. I... I... I can't. He never takes off that ring. Never. So for you to have it... You must have taken it off his dead body. Th that's too much. I didn't... Well, she could've. She could've. Lily, did you kill someone? A blonde boy? No, I don't know anyone like that. I... I only know you two. 
Mia and Claire. Then explain yourself. I can't. I'm sorry. I really can't. Something's not right here. This ring is the only clue I have. If I can figure out how it came into Lily's possession... Yeah, it could have. Not saying she did. You said you definitely don't know anyone named Owen, right? That's right. Claire explained to me about the new people living here, but she didn't tell me about anyone named Owen. What if she made Owen into Lily? Like, Lily kinda has the same hair color as Owen. And when that happened, were you already wearing this? Hmm? Yes, I suppose I was. I was lying in bed. I'd just woken up. Claire was sitting beside me, brushing my hair. When she realized I was awake, she started telling me about our lovely new guests. Oh shit, Elio, Elio, you might be onto something. I might be onto something, right? <laughs> I mean, she has full reign over this, so she could probably get Owen to make him into someone else and, like, alter his memories. She looks a lot like Owen, she does. What about before that? Before that? Before you fell asleep. Huh? I... It also explains why Goldie stand, Lily. Just like I thought, something's definitely wrong. Before, Claire was saying how long it had been since she'd seen anyone. How lonely she'd been. I'm sorry, I don't understand what you mean. Can you tell me anything about your past? Anything at all? I... I live here. With Claire. Freya, I fail to see how this is relevant. If you wish to talk amongst yourselves, kindly do it out of my sight. Lucas, you look so tired. It's relevant. Of course it's relevant. She has Owen's ring, but she doesn't remember how she got it. Claire told her about all of us, but not Owen. You don't think that's strange? Oh shit, oh shit, I was simping over Lily since she appeared and it turns out it was Owen, the boy I simped over since the beginning. <laughs> Yeah, I'm like 90% sure this is Owen. That, like, Claire altered. Well, yes, but... I'm close. I know it. To what? I'm not sure. But I have to keep pushing forward. For Lucas's sake, and Owen's, and even Lily's. Freya, what's wrong? I just went to apologize. I'm useless, aren't I? If I could just remember. But as always, I'm completely useless. If I can't be useful to people around me, then... Where's this coming from all of a sudden? Reassure her. I don't think you're useless, Lily. The fact that you have that ring is a vital clue. Even so, it's useless if I can't remember where I got it. My purpose is to make everyone around me comfortable and happy. If I can't do that, I'm useless. It sounds like something Owen would say. That tone. Who told you that? Who told? Hey, why are you giving me such a strange look? This is normal behavior for a model young woman, isn't it? I don't know what I've triggered here, but if I can keep her talking, maybe... Have I made you angry? Do I annoy you? Lucas is lost for words. I can't really blame him. This kind of emotional discussion isn't his strong suit. I encourage him. Hey. Y yes Talk to me. What's going on, that big brain of yours? Huh? Come on. I know you must be thinking something. Aren't you going to tell me she's secretly an alien? Uh, I, uh... Yeah, I thought so. There's something on his mind. But for whatever reason, he's afraid to say it. I know. I know you can't understand people. And maybe your way of thinking is different to mine. But that's not such a bad thing, isn't it? If there's something you want to say, then I think you should go ahead and say it. Trust yourself a little more. Or at least, trust that I'll support you. I... I was just... remembering something. A conversation. Lucas is afraid he's straight, oh no. God fucking damn it, I'm dead again! 
You are making a lot of mistakes today. Thanks for pointing it out. It's just unusual. I'm just distracted. Uh, this is where one asks, are you okay? Or something like that, I think. Do you want to talk about it? Do I annoy you? What? No, of course not. Oh, good. I got a letter from Mom today. Yeah, Owen even has the same eye color as Lily. And he just said, do I annoy you? His mother. Come to think of it, I don't think I've ever heard him mention his parents. A anyway, it's not important. Then, why did you bring it up? Huh? You wouldn't have brought it up if it weren't important to you. Ergo, it's important. <laughs> you got a weird way of saying things, man. Nah, I just... Sometimes... I wonder if things would have been easier if I'd stayed... Stayed home. I never wanted to hurt her. I just... But it's too late now. Gotta stop thinking about that shit. He still sounds troubled, but... Some of the sprite expressions are too similar to be a coincidence. In that case, shall we queue up for another round? Sure thing! At uh, that time, I wanted to reach out to him, but I couldn't find the words. I'm sure he was suffering, but he always kept it in. It feels like we're reaching a conclusion, a strange conclusion only Lucas could come to. A conclusion fitting for this strange, illusory world. Hell yeah, I sent for the same person this whole time. <laughs> Lucas and I keep looking at each other, waiting for the other to speak. One of us has to do it. It'll be painful. It has to be done. I'll do it. Okay, let's get this over from the beginning. We want to establish what happened to Owen. Lily, you have this ring, but you can't remember where you got it from. That's correct. You said Claire woke you up and told you about the three of us, but not about Owen. Hmm. I need you to really think, okay? Are you absolutely sure you don't know anyone by that name? Owen? No one by that name exists. He cannot exist. He definitely exists. Of course he exists. That ring is proof. Not anymore. Just forget that useless piece of shit ever existed. Just tell you Lily up front, hey girl, you're Owen, haha, -ha. life is crazy, right? He's denying it. He, I'm guessing he doesn't want to be himself. And Claire granted that wish or something. That way, everyone can be happy. Oh, uh, does, does he have a thing, like, where he had, like, a dead sister or something? What about you? Huh? Happiness. Regrets. Self-doubt. That's the truth of her existence. No, that's wrong. Not her, but... Oh, God. I'm so sorry, but I have to say it! We were right! We were right! Lily is Owen! Huh? You and Owen are the same person. That's how you got the ring. It was always yours. Huh? I don't know all the details. I don't need to. If you want to explain it later, I'll listen. If you don't want to, that's fine too. He was talking about his mother. That is his mother's name, maybe. All that matters to me right now is that you remember. This isn't you. No, you're wrong. This isn't the real me. I am a weak, selfish girl who hurts everyone. It's not true. I'm just making trouble for everyone. That's a lie. My life would be better if I just did what I was told. I was miserable back then. This is... This is... It's okay, Lily. Sorry, I shouldn't have let her wake you up. That's on me. Don't be regretful. This is the proof we've always been seeking, isn't it? 
I loved Owen for being a dumbass. I stayed for the self-loathing and hatred of oneself. Sobs. Nice. Being another's replacement or wanting to take someone's place. Oh, you were right to kill me the first time. Yeah, I guess you're right. Then I'll leave it up to you. Owen. Hey, come on. What are you crying for? Forgive me. <laughs> I can feel my eyes welling up. They're not tears of pain. They're tears of relief. I've been more of a silent Owen simp, but same, Goldie. Are you okay? You're not hurt? I have theories what's, for what's going on with Owen, but I'm not gonna say any. Kill her headache, but aside from that, I'm fine. Uh, about that. You can tell me later. Oh, right. Where's Mia? About that. Have you spoken with her? Yeah. She said she made a deal with Claire. Really? Claire didn't mention anything like that to me. Was she even intending to let them go in the first place? Yeah, she was probably just gonna hide that she kept them all. You just have to get Mia to change her mind, right? That's easy. Freya can just talk to her. I tried. But that time you'll have us with you. But this time you'll have us with you. Right. I guess it can't hurt to try. Just hang on, Mia. Alright, let's go, boys. Let's go find Mia so we can get out of here. Freya, thank you. I'm not sure if the devs are going with what I have in mind, with what I think is going on with Owen. But if so, then if they are doing what I think they have in mind, then they're genius. But I'm not going to say it, just in case. In case it is true. Because I would want it to be true, and I would want it to be a surprise if so. It's not in here. Okay. It's not in here. Oh, Freya, you haven't left yet? I've been busy, and I'm not going without you. I thought I told you not to worry about that. I'm actually kind of happy. I have a theory. Go ahead and share your theory then, Joe. What? I shall say my Owen trans headcanon now, and y'all can't stop me. You go, Goldie! Claire, she had a really tough life, you know? I think if I take care of her, I can heal her heart. She needs me. I need you! Oh, Freya. Not just me. What about your family? What about Lucas and Owen? They'll be fine. You'll all be just fine. I'm not going without you. Please, please don't do this. This is for your own good. No, it isn't. Open your eyes. She's manipulating you. Owen says trans rights. Hell yeah. What? I know. I know you just want to make everyone happy. Well, it's either Goldie's theory, or Owen made a deal with Claire to become a different person, but didn't go as intended. Instead, he was in the same situation. I knew I stand him for a good reason. <laughs> And I know that Lucas feels like he can't connect with other people. And I know that Owen feels insecure about himself. And she knows that too. She's using that to guilt you into staying with her. I'm just gonna say right now that I have the, I had the same theory, Goldie. That Owen is trans. That's the same theory I have. So if it turns out to be, then that would be super cool. But she really is so lonely. If I leave her... Even if she's lonely and hurting, that's not an excuse to make other people miserable. She's not your responsibility. I... Same hat, Elio. If it's true, we will ascend. I know. I know it's hard, but please, listen to me. If she wants everyone to stay with her, 
It should be out of love, not guilt. Otherwise, neither of you will be happy. Like, the whole thing with, uh, with Owen makes sense. Like, he left his parents and all of that. Like, he feels insecure and all that about himself. It makes sense if he is trans. And if not, then, well, it's a nice head cannon. Hell yeah. Freya, I... <laughs> Since when are you the one who gives pep talks? I guess I've changed. Psst, Freya, can we come in yet? Was that... He's back in good spirits already. I am joining in because the moment I realized Owen was probably Lily, I headcanoned him as trans. Trans rights, baby! What about you? Are you... I... I'll believe in you, Freya. Even if I can't believe in myself. Thank you. I guess we should go talk to Claire then? Yeah. There's a portal to our room through that closet. Me and the guys will follow you. My theory is similar to how I was raised. He was raised to be a replacement for a mom or a sister. But wasn't able to replace them. I know this from experience. I can also see that. Like, initially I thought he was having something similar to, uh... How Charles was with, uh, with Scarlet. So yeah, I can also see that. Hell yeah, we will. The whole gang's back together, huh? It feels good. My probs wish to be them to make others happy. Yeah. You're close to the end, by the way. I had a feeling that was close. I'm glad. Yeah. Save. Should be check in their book here. Okay, I guess I can't save there, I guess. I guess we should go talk to Claire then. Yeah. Alright, let's go. Let's go talk to Claire. Let me save. Record my thoughts. Alright. It's not oh, she's not in here. Man, would've thought she'd be in there. Damn. Not in here. Oh wait. Doi. Jump through the thing. Of course. Am I ready to face Claire? Yes. Ooh, her room's pretty. So you've come, all of you. Did our promises mean nothing? Keep it together, Mia. Just let Freya do the talking. I, I know. I know. Claire, we can't stay here. Why not? I could make you happy. All of you. I, I know I messed up. I was cruel. I'm sorry. I was just so scared. I can be better. I can change. I want to change. Sorry to disappoint you, but I was lying. I can't let you go. Sorry? What do you mean? I have ultimate power over this world, but only this world. I can't bridge between mine and yours. Then how is it that we were brought to you in the first place? The one who brought us here is our real enemy game's master, or my patron. Hmm. My patron? Eh? The reason I was able to play Claire's game, the ability to retrace, that power wasn't from Claire, but someone else. Matenma, I'm ready to go home. Huh, is it over already? You've disappointed me, Claire. Why does she look so terrified? Owen is a healer because he's associated with food. <laughs> you, on the other hand, have done fantastically well, Freya. Truly, an outstanding performance. I don't like either of these. I... Quiet as ever. I have some friends you'll get along just fine with. Now, this will hurt. D don't... What was that? Don't... Please... 
Just let her go. What? Well, look who's changed her tune. Just let them all go home, please! Claire, what are you talking about? I thought my patron was a reference to the game's Patreon page. <laughs> She'll make you like her. You'll never be able to return home. Whatever she promises you, don't believe her. It isn't... It isn't worth it. Hush. Now, hold still. Like her? Like Claire? I don't... Fuck that! I won't allow it! Excuse me? It seems Claire has yet to revoke my power over these creatures. How fortunate. You two. Three. Sorry. How sweet and completely pointless. Hmm? Her attack didn't work? This might be an opening! Think, Freya, think! Why couldn't Matenma attack Lucas, Owen, and Lily? The strength of their power, the source of their powers, they were protected. I think it might be the source. Is it to do with where they got their powers? Lucas just said Claire gave him his powers. She's also the one who turned Owen into Lily. And what was she saying before? She has ultimate power of the, this world, and this world alone? In this world, is Claire more powerful than Matenma? Claire! Claire! Wake up! We fighting God now? Didn't know we were playing a JRPG! <laughs> There'll be none of this. Go back to sleep, Claire. Yes, ma'am. She doesn't know! No! Not like Matenma purposely hid it from her. Claire, do you love me? Huh? I said go to sleep, girl. Claire, whose world is this? Be quiet. Isn't it yours? Claire! It's... Mine? Mine. It's mine. Lie back down and sleep, worm. No. I... Love Freya more than I fear you. Even if she doesn't feel the same... I'll still protect her. Hell yeah, thank you, Yandere baby! And I don't want to be her game piece anymore! The power of gay saves the day yet again. Hell yeah! Is that so? Don't give me such a frightening look. I know where I'm not wanted. Without me, you'll be stuck here for all eternity, alone. It's fine. Well then, as long as you understand that... Let's go, lesbians! Let's go! I'll even do you a favor, and let all your little friends go home, so you can be truly alone. Goodbye then, children. It was a fun interlude. That's... Me in the background just not doing anything. The way out? I thought so. I'm not human enough to go back to your world anymore. But you... You can go now. It's over. Mia is the support gay. <laughs> I mean, you're right, Goldie. Please, before I stop you... Oh boy. I love you, Claire. Please don't. Just go before I stop you. Thank you. I'm happy to hear you say that. Which is ironic, since Mia is literally the one dating the protag. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's actually rather sweet once you get to know it. I'll take your word for it. I find myself suddenly exhausted. Perhaps we should leave. I will follow your lead in any case. You've yet to lead me wrong. That you remember, anyway. Yeah! <laughs> remember the time we got you killed because we were salty? Are you okay? Yeah, just... 
I know. It's a big moment. I'll wait for you, okay? Ah, how embarrassing. Huh? Well, I only intended to show up to bravely protect you before disappearing again, but it seems I've gotten stuck. Weird. Perhaps you've acquired a consciousness of your own. As long as you're there and I'm here, I'm happy. Indeed. Mm, I think I'm going to go rest. Be well, all of you. Ready when you are, Frey. Can I talk to Claire one more time? Hmm? Okay, guys. I'm gonna ask you guys the question. Should I say- I have a feeling if I say I'm not going anywhere, I'm gonna get an end where I don't go anywhere. So should I say I'm not going anywhere, or should I go through the portal? Ah. Hmm. I kind of want to say I'm not going anywhere. Okay. I'm not see. Uh, I'm not going anywhere. Okay. I'm not going anywhere. I'd say the state ending first. Gotcha. Huh? The hell do you think you're doing? I'm... I'm going to stay. Here. With Claire. You... What? That's what I want to know. Freya, are you certain about this? I am. I want to stay here. I... I can stay instead. Mia... But that's not what you two want, huh? I... I get it. I, I have been replaced as the girlfriend. I don't. I mean, hey, maybe you two can find a way back together. If anyone can do it, it's you. I'll be waiting. I... Thank you. Let's go, Owen. You... You... You better fucking come back! Both of you! Damn it! Oh wait, but they went through so much just for Freya to be like, I'm staying here to be gay, bye y'all! <laughs> They'll find a way out. I'll also be waiting patiently. I'm certain you will discover a way out. Freya! Just us now, I guess. And the giant eyeball sentinel thingy. Mia accepted that Claire is now Freya's god girlfriend. <laughs> yeah. I, um, didn't expect you to choose me. I mean, I've been simping you for this entire game, so... You did all of this expecting to lose? When you put it like that... So, what now? I'll start this world again. We can build it together. I'll teach you. Do you really think you can find a way for us to return to the real world together? Okay, but Freya has two hands, so... That is also correct, Goldie. Though we'll find a way out so that they can hold Mia's hand as well. Well, I didn't expect to be able to banish Matenma, so who knows. If you do, will you still choose me? I'll choose you and Mia, baby. Always. Oh, Freya... Until then, I promise, I'll make a world where we can be happy together. Wait, Freya is the name of a Nordic goddess. Huh. Well. <laughs> a world for just the two of us. And then they were gay. We got the gay end. Well, all of them are gay ends, so. Thank you for playing. Credits. Let's see the credits. Miles White, Art Domi, Rest Orange, Narrative Consultation by T Powered Games, Florencia Menizzi, Additional Resources, Yee! Claire, Freya, Mia. Oh! Yo, I like this song! Hold 
know. Let me turn the music up. I like this song. I'm gonna go quiet for a bit. Was the end of the song. in this game yeah I think it's done yeah highly would recommend getting the soundtrack just for that song alone but okay let's do the other ending now then shall we there you go <laughs> there you go Mason God, that song was so good. Also, let me know how the audio is, because I turned it up for the song, and I just turned it back down. So, just let me know. We yacht again. <laughs> oh, okay. It's good for me? It's not showing the nya for me? What do you mean? Yeah, it's all right for me too. Nice. Okay. Well, let's do the ending where we don't become gay gods with Claire, I guess. Mm, let us go. I really fucked up, huh? I should have known better than to think I could win the heart of someone like you. I had already lost before we even started. Like, it's not showing you ordered it? Like it didn't take the points away or something? If so, you have just found an error in the system. Sorry to disappoint you, but I was lying. Yeah. My patron. At least you saw it, Elio. 
Doesn't show that I wasted points or that it was redeemed. So now you just have unlimited points, I guess, Mason. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, truly an outstanding performance. Oh no, we're only just getting started, hmm? No, this will hurt. Don't. Same for me, it just didn't appear. I don't know how it looks typically for you guys since I use the stream manager, so I have an activity feed thing in the corner that pops up whenever someone uses points. Oh, is that? I also get notified when people follow me, but I tend to not do shoutouts when people follow just in case for like lurkers. I don't want them to feel like. I don't know. I always get weird whenever I join a stream and like people call me out unless I specifically want them to call me out. So I try not to do that. Don't, please just let her go. What? Well, look who's changed her tune. Just let them all go home, please. Claire, what are you talking about? Yeah. Leaves a message in chat saying it redeemed whatever we spend points on. Okay. E. And source of their powers. I wonder how many ends are in this game. The guide I have open doesn't say what all ends are in this game, so... Huh. Wonder... Did you get an end if you go here? No. Okay. What's the dot 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 answer say? Aw. Okay. Guess all that's left is to go through the portal. <laughs> Don't look so sad. This... this is fine, too. I'm glad I got to play with you for a while. I assume there are two, depending on what you answer here. Yeah. Is that the way out? It certainly looks like it. Then let's fucking go already! Freya? I... Yeah. Fresh air! Is that done breaking? Hey Freya, did I do the right thing? Yes, we both did. I'm sure of it. <laughs> I wish I had your confidence. You know, that offer's still there. Offer? To stay at mine. I mean, it's not night anymore, but... Oh, I like that. Uh, hey, hold on a minute! Lucas! Yes? Y you! Come over to my place! Right now, I was supposed to study today. Fuck studying! Think those two will be okay? They'll figure it out. Probably. Hope so. And us? We can figure it out too. I'd like that. All the gay in the air. Hell yeah. All right. Let me see. I think those were yes yeah, so these are Owen and Lucas I'm not sure why the achievement doesn't show up but yeah to me is end yeah these are all the have people survive stuff e so yeah looks like we did everything so we got this great ass music all right well that was a really fun game I really liked it there are some parts that I had problems with. 
I think that the, the retrace system probably has a bit of bugs that they need to get worked on. But as a game itself, like standing alone by itself, I think this is a really, really good game. I like the music, I like the art, and I like the gameplay of it. I like the little bits of like Freya recognizing stuff like because of all of the time loops and stuff. It's really good. I really like uh, time stuff, like time loops and stuff like that. So this was definitely my type of game. Oh, also hello, Okami. We just finished Retrace. But yeah, I think this is a great game and I think the creators are working on some other games as well, correct? I'm really, I am really looking forward to it. Also, thank you for telling me about this game, Crimson Red Thread. I know that uh, your friend is the one that uh, made this game, or at least did the art for it, right? So yeah, this was really good. And yeah, watch Madoka Magica if you like this stuff. Watch ReZero and play Witch's Heart as well. And maybe read Higurashi and Umineko. <laughs> but yeah, uh, so I'm gonna give you guys the uh, their Twitter to follow because I think they deserve a follow, you know. Support your devs and all that. So, here is their Twitter. I am following them right now. And I'm looking forward to any other stuff that they do in the future. This is a really good game. And let me see. Let me find... Yeah, Domis. Yeah, and Crimson Red Thread just posted the artist who is their friend, Omi. But yes, this was a really good game. I'm glad I stuck with it and finished it. It was really fun. And I highly recommend to check it out in your own time. It costs money on itch.io, but I think it's worth it. And the devs are really nice with helping you out because I left a comment asking how to get like the ends and they help me out so yeah definitely definitely give them a check out but yeah i'm gonna take a quick break and we'll get back into your turn to die so yeah <laughs> 